Sorry, I'm panting at the uh, anticipation of playing more Zero Time Dilemma. The best weeb game that we've ever played on stream. The best weeb game we've played on stream so far. I can see OBS, I can see the view counter, because that's important to me for some reason. I can see chat. Hey, hey, Grumpy. Hey, Wuggy, how's it going? Do you partake in investing? I do not, no, I don't. I'm not a part of that scene. Um, no, not really. I probably should. So here's the thing. Um, I don't really give a shit about money, but I do give a shit about, like... Um, being able to provide for the family, obviously, but past that, like, I, I, my ambitions in life are to, like, I have certain things I want to achieve, and they involve money, but money is not the goal, you know, like, I don't want money just for money, I, I would like money, you know, to, to set the family right, and then after that, you know, just the things I want to achieve, you know, money is, is the thing that gets you there, I don't know if that's how most people think, um, obviously there are some people who, that money is like a point system for them and that's it. But yeah, I think most people probably agree with what I just said. My brother's dog is barking a lot. My brother's also called Joe. Can you do a better job, please? I don't, I don't know what that means. I feel slandered. But I'm not Carlos, so it's fine. Life is simply unfair to anything. Yeah, 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 it's true. It's pretty true. It's pretty true. It's pretty true. It's pretty true. All right. So we played for three hours and 49 minutes yesterday. Pretty, pretty good. All right. Load save. How about starting Neon White Sundays on any, any convenient day? I, I have, come on, come on. I've streamed enough, have I not? Like, come on. Like, like. I, st I stream so much in July. Wow, that's a lot of gift subs. Thank you so much, Annie, for Prez. Not the first round of gift subs from you either. Very generous. Thank you so much. When I started streaming in July, I streamed for the most of the rest of the month. Like, come on. Like, almost the rest of that was just, was just streamed all the way. So, you know. I, I don't know. Like, I don't know how much I want to stream. Um, yeah. Joe, I dunked on your neon white square. It's probably not that hard. Turn on Bob, Bob the Snail too. What? Streamer says he hates streaming. I don't hate streaming. It's just um, it's very tiring, and uh, I don't think anyone knows that unless they've streamed themselves, or maybe some of them do. But like even I forget how tiring it tiring it is. Even sometimes during the stream, I forget. And I will go upstairs and I will just sit there. Usually when the stream's done, it's around dinner time. And I'll go upstairs and have dinner with the family. And I'm just sitting there just just quietly devastated. <laughs> just, just like, oh my god. <laughs> just just wiped. Um, so it's like you for you forget, you know? Just like, it's fine. But, you know. <laughs> Would you ever do face camming it? Maybe. I don't know. Like, so I'm kind of paranoid so like i purposefully made myself look different when i did face cam before than i usually look uh usually i have longer hair usually i have a full beard um like i have right now i have longer hair and i have a full beard right now um so like i don't know like i'm trying to get more comfortable about certain things and trying to trying to work on confidence and self-esteem like I, i'm not that happy with how i look but you know like i know I know my place in life, but it's still, it's still not nice to put yourself out there like that, you know? Like, I don't know. I think I'd be uncomfortable. I don't know. I kind of like that our stream is just, you just see the game and you hear, like, I don't even have sub notifications and shit, you know? I don't even do that. 
Do you go to the gym? I do not go to the gym, no. I'm not I'm not a gym bunny, no. I will make a B B Koi VTuber avatar for free. Oh man, it's free. It's free. I remember you having them like in 2017. Yeah, and that, and I don't have them anymore. It's like you know, I I learned a lot about streaming and what I want and everything like that. So, um, yeah. There's probably a happy middle ground between what I used to have and what I do now, or a happy middle ground between what most streamers have and what I do now. I think it's kind of cool that some streamers go the extra mile and they put extra, they have like custom sub notifications that are based on the game that they're playing, you know, like um, kind of like the emote that we have for plus two minus two. They would have like a zero escape themed sub notification shows up. It's like, ooh, look, you're supporting that, you know, that, that's kind of neat. Um, it's a lot of work, but it's kind of neat. Uh, but like, I, I don't know, like, it's it's fine. Co got a full team for this. So does he? There's a full team behind Co Car. It's just it's just me, man. It's just me. It's just me. Joker question: What is your favorite Dungeons and Dragons class? Um, the only Dungeons and Dragons class that I have played is Paladin, so I don't have one. Or if I have one, it would be that. Um, as a paladin, I was able to do some pretty cool shit, so I was happy with that. Um, but if I was to play another character, uh, maybe I would want to be, like, a ranged character? I think, I think, um, a spellboy would be a little too complicated for me, because I'm still a Dungeons & Dragons noob. Um, but yeah. What oath? I was Oath of Glory. My, my sta standout shiny moment was actually recently before uh, I, ha I had to drop from the group um, was using divine. Oh, man, I can't remember what the spell is called. This, this like the group had to tolerate this a lot. They were so patient with me, um, like just not knowing the rules and shit, um, just not knowing the names of things too. <laughs> was was using um, divine uh, inspiration or something to have acrobatics uh, boost and movements boost in order to um, immediately like launch vertical double jump right into the air in a room when we were fi fighting something that was, it was like a beholder, but it was a smaller beholder and it was flying up in the air and we couldn't get to it. And a after jumping up to hit it with my sword, uh, I rolled a crit. And that was just like, spectator, thank you, uh, the person who obviously knows what that is. Um, it was a spectator. And uh, roll, rolled a crit and w w jumping in the air and essentially just cleave this thing right in half. And that, and that, was, uh, that was my paladin's probably finest moment in the entire campaign. Um, yeah, that, that was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. Play a warlock, you get great range attacks and some spells, but not too much. How many how many Dungeons and Dragons heads are in the chat? Before that, we found um, uh, I think it was two not at the same time two ropers, and that was the first time I ever heard of this this monster before, and that was fucking cool. Those are scary, man. They look scary too. Ropers are are insane. Like that that was that was fun. That was fun. Yeah. I don't know. I, I had a good time, but I felt very out of my element. Um the the group dynamic, I don't want to say too much about the group dynamic, especially naming names or whatever, because I don't know how, how, how kosher that is. Um I will say that there is someone in the chat right now who who was in the group, you know. And um and I did something else that was kinda like Dungeons and Dragons with, with a couple other people that were in the chat. Um so uh like the it was a it was a little awkward um, that again, I didn't really know the rules all, all that all that much, and they knew that going in, or or at least the the, the DM did, um, and was fine with it, uh, with being patient. Um, but two of two of the the people that were in the party were uh, were or are uh, very very experienced, um, and have done quite a lot of of campaigns and everything. 
And then there was me and someone else who uh, were not that experienced, and it was our, it was our first, our our first uh, first campaign. Um, and the uh, the difference between the approaches of of the two experienced people and the other two <laughs> varied wildly. <laughs> Just like, like, oh shit, someone's talking to me. Oh no, uh, 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 like what, what would my character do in this, in this moment? Yeah, but anyway, I played, I played, um, a character, I played a man named, uh, like, I, I forgot my character's name in the first session and I had to decide because I wrote it out and I hadn't decided the pronunciation. At one point, it was like, Rousset, like, like, like a potato. And then it turned into, like, Roussel. And then at the end, it was like, like, Rousseau. And that was, that was the guy's name. And he was a, a, a painting paladin. And uh, it was, it was a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, unfortunately, I had to drop out of the group because, um, it's been nuts around here, uh, and it still is nuts. Um, it's hard to get that amount of time, especially at the time that we were at. It was uh, coincided with uh, bedtime, and that has gotten really rough over the past few months. Um, but I played. Uh, I mean, I could just ask the person, but I don't want to. I don't want to out them like they're here. I think. I think it was. Was it one night a week? For was it six months? It was about six months, wasn't it? It was about six months, I think. Um, so, like, it, it was a fairly extensive campaign. I don't, I don't know how 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 long they usually go, um, but yeah, it was it was interesting. I, I really got a lot out of it, not just as for enjoyment, but also like I, I never played a tabletop game before, apart from some board games. So it was nice to get into like an area of gaming that I've never been in before. Um, and, and it was fun. It's, 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 um, it's a very different experience, even though when you get into combat, it can start feeling like a video game, but the amount of flexibility and the, and the amount of ideas you have and just like, Hey, I can do this and you can actually just like riff off an idea or something. Um, is, is really really fun and like riffing off another character uh i did i did a a, a, a cyberpunk themed one shot um was it last week or the week before i can't remember now and um in that one it, i don't know if one shot is is the proper terminology but it's basically like you just play this character for one session and that's it um and uh that was that was uh, fun for like for a different reason that i had a little bit more experience i knew what what was what it was more going in um, and riffing off another character that was in the group there was, was a lot of fun. And I felt, I felt a little bit more comfortable with that. And instead of being like, oh, let's, let's stand and fight or whatever. Just like, you know what? Instead, I'm just going to shoot this window and jump out of it and just do some, some crazy <laughs> shit, <laughs> but it's fun. Uh, anyway, I, sorry, I could just talk forever. You know me, man. <laughs> you played it for, yeah, I played the, a cyberpunk weeb. I fucking hated that shit. Still angry. <laughs> you all stood in fight. We just left. We're just like fuck this. We're just shooting the window and we're just jumping out. <laughs> and and one of the other guys after after it got bad was playing like the cyberpunk cowboy and was like so like the way the way uh, okay so the the way that two of us got out the window was that the other person had a flying like like slow fall suit so the, so we shot the window and then we jumped out of, of the building and uh, he had a slow slow fall suit i didn't my character had a flail all right so my character had a flail so i said i, I i'm gonna use the heavy part of the flail as an anchor and i'm just gonna jump out the window and hope that weighs me down and then when it when it weighs me down I'll, it'll soften my fall so so i did that um and and it was like okay roll and i can't remember if it was acrobatics or agility or whatever whatever it was that what the check was and i rolled really really high and and i survived without any issue so it was so so me and the other character just ran away all right and the the other the rest of the team was up, upstairs that decided not to jump out the window like with us like idiots you know just just firing against this SWAT team that had come into the building and then so so it starts to go really bad we're gone we're gone like my character had th three uses of a subway ticket left so he was on the metro <laughs> he, he whipped out his metro pass and said peace out suckers I'm off. So, so the rest of the three were up there fighting fucking, fucking Night City police. It wasn't Night City, but you know what I mean. Um, 
Uh, did you stop one station early? Someone said that. Someone made that joke in the ch in, in the voice call. Anyway, so so they're they're up there fighting, and then there's one of the someone died. There was four of them up there. Someone died, and so then the cyberpunk cowboy of the group was like, "All right, it's time to follow follow suit and jump up the window." Did this really this really cool kind of kind of phrase like, "All right, it's high noon, time to get out of here," and then just. Loved the, the agility check, fell out the window, and died. <laughs> just, <laughs> just died. <laughs> yeah, so that, so, so we we uh we got out, and uh, one of the persons survived too, um, and uh, that that was fun. Yeah. A uh, D and D stream went. I don't know. I don't know about that. That that could be fun, but. Uh, I don't know how that would that would go. Oh, and I don't know what the time would be on it too. Who's your Who's your second favorite character so far since Carlos is best boy? I like Grumpy. Grumpy's pretty good. Oh, trying to trying to get me back on topic and on track here. Okay, I see how it is. I I see how it is. So did you role play in Dungeons Dragons? I tried, but I wasn't very comfortable with it. it, it very outside of my outside of my comfort zone. Um, I have this problem where um, whenever I talk to someone, um, I need them to be having a good time. Um, and this is why you might think, okay, well, how do you stream then if you have that that kind of issue? Well, when I'm streaming, I don't hear you guys talking. So it's like if I was on call with someone else, I would be like. Or in a group, I would be pretty quiet. I think because I need to make sure the other people are having a good time whenever I'm talking. Like I, I'm, I'm very, I have, I have a lot of issues when it comes to like overanalyzing the reactions of things. Um, so like I, I like it that I'm like solo, like flying solo on the stream because I can just riff and do whatever, and I, and I know I'm not talking over anyone. And if anyone doesn't want to sit here and listen to me, they can just leave. You know what I mean? Whereas if it's in a group, um, it's, it's, it's that sort of thing. Joe, shy. I am shy actually. Maybe I am shy. Maybe that is it. Like I'm okay with like talking to people. And talking to strangers i'm okay but yeah so whenever it was my character's turn to talk i always got like okay is is this funny am i am i am i uh am i not wasting people's time right now you know and it's stupid i shouldn't feel that way and no one no one made me feel that way it's it's just it's just me it's just leftover shit that my parents inflicted on me i think you know um, I said this on a QA and a before that m my dad inflicted me with this this really like lifelong issue of like we will play Zero Escape today, I swear. Uh, my dad inflicted me with this lifelong issue of, like, whenever my dad saw me having a good time, like, he would be like, okay, let's go over and ruin this. <laughs> and, then, and it sounds fucked up, and it can be a little funny, like, out of context. But that's that's what my that's what my dad would be like, you know? Like, he, he would always be like, uh, you know, you can't have a good time around 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 my father. Um, I don't know if he did it to everyone else in the house or it was, or it was just me. Um, but like, so like, I don't know, like there, there are certain things that, uh, that make me, that make me nervous and everything. So yeah. Um, I, I feel that in me too, because you, you learn from your parents and I, I, and I try very hard to keep that in check and I think I mostly succeed or maybe completely succeed. I don't know. I don't know. Was it because men can't be chill? No, I don't think it was like that. At least I don't, I don't know. My dad's still alive. If I ever spoke to him again, I might be able to find out. But um, I haven't spoken to my dad in almost 20 years. Um, and my mom's dead. My mom's been dead for a while. Anyway, let's uh, let's play the game. Uh, are we going Q team, D team? Who did we go last time? Okay, it looks like we've done one of each. So we're back on D team now, right? Okay, so let's do a, a quick recap of what's going on or what I understand it. So we're in a in a bunker, in a bomb shelter bunker that's near the Mars test site where we were all for we were all in there for five days and now we've somehow been abducted to a bomb site nearby. Um, we've gone through this and everyone survived, although it seems like we could possibly change that and make everyone, make one group dead. And we are going through this game that has a non-linear progression path of, uh, I can't, I can see it. Hold on. Um, a non-linear progression path of what can happen. Now I'm guessing that these are like 
there's two available if if um q team's dead and there's two available if uh c team's dead or maybe these are if if any group is dead then these unlock or i don't know maybe, maybe or maybe these are from doing different options or something i don't know um i guess we'll find out i don't know um how do i go back i go back to the flow uh so like see here like we did this down here but oh, we got lucky that we somehow picked the, the two that were right after this. Thank you for the gifted subs, No Longer Hollow. Thank you. Uh, that's the, the second set from you, is it not? I remember saying that name before. Thank you very much, No Longer Hollow. Um, so this th this is uh, we got lucky here. Um, so how did we get down here? You ask. Well, because there it's non-linear. So like we can go. Uh, oh. Oh what? Oh, that's kind of cool. It corresponds to what's there. Okay. I have a feeling this is going to expand at some point. So these could be anywhere on on the timeline grid thing, the flow the flow chart, and the way it justifies um, how you can do them out of order is that the characters, but not you, the characters are um, experiencing forced bouts of amnesia uh, between each room uh, through their bracelets. That's what the bracelets do this time. Um, obviously setting up some some twist where at some point someone has not been getting amnesia and has just been pretending or some shit um but it also affords the the, the fact that you can experience it out of order and i'm guessing that skips a lot of the shitty downtime that you otherwise would in the other games um so I, i'm not memeing and i'm not trying to be a contrarian i really am sorry i know i don't really feel like i am a, that much of a contrarian despite having that opinion because you know um i didn't like like two games as much as as most people um but i do understand that so shit that sometimes I can go against um, the grain of, of stuff like this, like with with um, with one of the Dangarampa games as well. Um, like I wasn't memeing and I wasn't doing it on like 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 making a joke yesterday. Like so far, this is by far the best one in terms of beginning. Um, like it's cutting out a lot of bullshit, man. Like like the pacing is just off the charts better than the first two. Um, the pacing of the first one wasn't that bad. The pacing of the second one was abysmal. Like it, it took too long to get to the good stuff and you could argue that maybe that's a good thing when you look at it holistically because it makes one of the first like oh shit moments have that much more punch but then it completely shits the bed at the end um it also repeats a lot of bullshit of getting to the different game over routes and everything in the second one so i don't know we'll see um but yeah so far this is by far the best one uh it has the best character interactions of all um, the fact that they changed the camera initially was kind of weird to me, but now it, it affords this kind of like group dynamic conversations that you can see and you can, you can see them looking at each other and interacting more. It, it still looks kind of bad. Don't get me wrong. But, um, instead of being anchored by one perspective and, and their thoughts all the time, you can just see them interact more. Um, so I, so far I definitely like it better than the first two at this stage, but let's see how it pans out or whatever. Anyway, we're going to go D team. Uh, that looks like the Q room. Should we go there? D -d 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 team I kind of want to do the gun the gun stop the gun kind of branches out a little bit uh, I want to do actually can we see the flow chart did we do the first one for D team we didn't or right, I, I need one that has one two and then two down here and then three down there was that Ooh. actually the gun no it's not that all right let's see uh, is it this one no this one no all right so it's this one somehow still no um is it one of the locked ones or is it just look different and it's this one here um fuck it we're doing we're doing the gun we're doing the gun fuck it let's do it Fire! Oh, shit. This room is... Fire. The trash disposal room. Oh, man. All right. Isn't that what it's called on the map? Let's put Eric in it. Wait. Where's Vi? I don't know. You don't know? When I woke up, she was already gone. Suspicious. Maybe she managed to get out of this room. Do you think we can? It opened. Sigma, it opened. And? Uh, um, well, I didn't really expect it to, so... Fi? Fi! 
What the hell are you doing in there? Cutting my next album? What do you think I'm doing? <laughs> I'm locked in here. You're locked in? Why? How should I know? This is where I was when I woke up. Stuck inside this incinerator. In the trash where you belong. Hang on, we'll get you out now. Damn it! It's locked. Is there a keyhole? I don't see one. Probably an electronic lock. <sighs> I've got a bad feeling about this. Nice Star Wars reference. Talking about that best girl. Is this the only game of the three that actually has like an actual waifu debate? Like in the first game, it's clearly Akane. In the second game. It's clearly um, Luna, and in this one, uh, it's between Akane and Mira. Like, yeah, it's it, it, there's actually a debate between two. Pretty good. All right. Oh man, Stardew Valley. Do. Do, 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 it's gonna do, be okay, do, do. fine. It's not Stay though. calm. You're the one flailing and freaking out here. Anyway, we have to do something. Either stop the incinerator startup, or unlock the door. Okay. I'll see if I can do anything on this side. I'm counting on you. That should be my line. Hey, I'd like to avoid the worst sunburn of my life in here. Shut up. Let's hurry. Right. Seek way out. Oh, there's the A. Okay. But a bit of bomb, but on, but on, bomb, bomb, but a bit of bomb, but on, but on, bomb, bomb, but a bit of bomb, but on, but on, bomb, bomb. All right. So, um, let's use the mouse to move. Even though I'm like, okay, there's, a, is that a gun? Wait, was this the one with the gun? This is. Oh, I get it. This shows how trash is categorized. Oh man, where are you up here then? We could put fight under the guy. This is no time for jet. <laughs> Let's just hurry and save her. Uh, alright. This door isn't locked, so we can go into the hall whenever we want, but no way we're abandoning fire. We have to stop the processor, open the incinerator door. Okay. What the hell's that? What's this? Is that a button? Looks like it. There are four screws holding the cover in place. You could get something through there and poke that button. Come on. You could do that. What the hell is this? Stop. It says stop here, so maybe it'll stop the incinerator process. Hmm. If it does, then that's one less thing to worry about. Let's find the key that fits this. We definitely feel calmer once fire is safe. Wait a second. Isn't this keyhole too big? For what? The door is locked, but there's no keyhole. Probably an electronic lock. This door connects to the incinerator, right? If we can open it, then Fi can. Oh, a fire extinguisher! No, it's a, this is, a, is this a gas torch? All right, let's give more fire. Small glass torch. This makes me want to see sear some meat or fish. If we make it our s out safely, I definitely want to eat something nice. All right. You can see I'm just fine. This the stench from the trash pile in the back is gagging me though. Thank God. We need you to get out quick. Have you found anything helpful over there? Nothing yet. It's too dark to look around. Can you see if you can make it brighter in here? Okay, got it. We'll see what we can do. All right, we're gonna have to direct fire at some point. Oh, what the hell is this? A, Z. Huh. I think moving the slider changes the letter. I wonder what it's for. Maybe getting the correct combination will stop the incinerator. Ah, uh, not likely. But it's still worth a shot to see if it does. Let's spell Phi! I know the alphabet. Phi! Oh, it just... It just does it? Gab! Okay. So, just I just need to, like, cycle through. Okay. Hmm, well, that was wrong. I don't think we have all the information. We need to find clue first. There are a bunch of meters here. Is this a thermometer? It must measure the temperature inside the incinerator. Is that a coin at the base of the needle? Why would it be there? Let's take it. 
Okay. This looks like a, like a control console, but nothing's happening when we touch it. All right. This looks like a dust chute. Dust chute? If it is, do you think it's connected to the inside of the incinerator? Possibly, but it looks like it's locked. Oh, I think we can put some numbers here. G. So, a weight of something? 100 G. No? 150 G. Man, it makes it hard to guess, huh? Guessing won't work, I suppose. We don't have enough information yet. Let's look for a hint. I wonder if there's something we can use inside this locker. Is this a mask with goggles? They do nothing. Oh, we can be zero. This looks like a gas mask. Why would we, why would something like this be here? Why not try it on? You might look good. If you think complimenting everything a woman wears is okay, you're very wrong, sir. Eh. Let's put them together. I don't know what to do. All right, there we go. I did it. It's a toolbox. All right, let's open it. It's toolbox. We can't open it because it's screwed shut. And the tool to open it is inside the box. Damn easier. All right, let's just fucking weld it then. Let's bust it up. Come on. All right, well, I'm done. I think there's something in the box hanging from the ceiling. That's, I think it's a revolver, and if, if it's real, maybe we can use it for something, but we can't reach it from here. Right, and if we got to it, there's a padlock on it. Hmm, what should we do? Okay, let's, uh... Wait, what? Hey, Sima, over here, I can see some images in the air. What are they? Uh, a screwdriver and two screws, I think. Maybe it's some sort of clue. Let's take note of it. I think we can put some numbers in here. Why don't we give it a try? Uh, two screws and a screwdriver. I don't... I don't know. One, one, two. No, okay. What's this gonna do with the screwdriver and screws, I'd say? Then that means we don't have enough information. We can't get lucky every time. You're right, let's search around for more clues to open. Oh, okay, all right, okay, 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 okay. All right, that's true, it's true. Tick, yeah, I see it, yeah, okay. Oh, there are letters floating with the poster, huh? Where, right here, the tick in plastic is circled in big letters. Ah, you must be able to see that because of the goggles you have on. I think you call this augmented reality, but why do only these letters appear? Hmm, okay, so tick is what I have to put into the thing over there. Tick. Tick. All right, completed. Uh, this should be the right answer. Good job, the shutter opened. I did it. Now I can see in here. I'll try to look for something useful. Wait, useful? All right, screw. Okay, um, is that it? All right, I'm looking around on this side. Oh, now we're fine. Okay, so it will change our perspective to different characters. We're not just anchored with, um, with, uh, whatchamacallit? With the team leaders. That's interesting. All right, cool. All right, so screwdriver over here. Hey, this is... Okay, flathead screwdriver. The worst kind of screwdriver. Nothing special about a flathead screwdriver. The grip is hexagonal. It's just a tool for taking screws off. All right. It's a weight station. I'll try weighing the screwdriver. 133 grams. Okay, so 133 grams plus two screws. What's a screw gonna weigh? 20? Can you hear me, Diana? How's it going over there? We're searching everywhere. All right, do we have the screwdriver now? We don't. Give us the fucking screwdriver, Fi. How are you doing over there, Fi? All right, I'm looking around this side. Why don't we, can we do it here? This is the hole for the dust chute. It's impossible to send things from this side. Um, what? There's nothing I can use this pile of trash, man. It really stinks. Is, oh, is this a window? Can we throw it through? 
Diana Sigma over there. Damn, why am I here? It's better than the only one that got locked in. Diana Sigma, I'm counting on you guys. All right. Oh, can we unlock that? Or unscrew that? This wall is screwed on. I doubt it's connected to the outside, though. May as well take it off. Yeah, why not? 188 pounds. Is this some sort of clue? 188 pounds? I'll hold on to the screws just in case. Ah! Uh, Alright, why 188 pounds? That's kind of weird. A weight station. I'm going to weigh these screws. Alright, so 22 plus 133 is 155, right? That's what it was? Was 133? I'm pretty sure it was 100. That means it's 155, right? 22 grams, each one is 11 grams. Let's go do it. 155. We're searching everywhere. One five five. Oh, it's pretty close with 150 then. Oh, it's open. I knew these were the correct numbers. Well done. Now we can send things to the other side. All right. All right. Let's send. Let's send the mask. Oh, the goggles don't fit in the shoe. Oh, of course they do. Of course they don't. All right. Let's send. This and then they'll open it. Let's get this toolbox to fire. Yeah, she should be able to open it since she has a, has a screwdriver there. Why doesn't she just send the screwdriver? Hey, fire! I'm sending the toolbox down the chute. Please take it. Oh, is it a one-way shoot? Got it. Oh, okay. What's inside? Huh? It's some kind of puzzle in here. Oh, wonderful. Oh, for fucks. Oh, it's another one of these things. Okay. I'm sensing a pattern. What was the, the button to change it again? W, control, no. Uh, shit. Q, E, Z. Shift doesn't work. Oh, clicking the X. All right. So again, that one, it can't go there. It can't, it can go there. Oh no, this one's harder. It can go there, but well, it can't go there because then it's blocking too, and there's nothing else that could fit up there. Um, can it go this way? It could go there. Okay, maybe this one is the uh, the one to start with. Where's the break in? Let's get cracking. All right, that can't go there. Can't go there. It could go there. Okay, let's let's be more methodical about this. If it's facing up. That is the only place it can go. If it's facing to the right, that is the only place it can go. Oh, it could go up here, either way. But then there's nothing that could go up here. So it can go here, or it could go down there. Is there anything that would fit in here if, if it did? No, right? I think I'm right. There's nothing that would fit in here, because then the, those squares wouldn't be there. Okay, so it can't go there. So there's there's no way that it can go facing right. Okay, so let's go down. The square, yeah, the square does, but then these two don't get used, and they all have to be used, right? I'm assuming that it's the same as last time that they all have to that they all have to get used. All right, so let's keep going. I don't think it can go there. All right, let's go. Uh, facing, facing down, facing down. Oh wait, hold on, I'm dumb. One second, no, nothing can go there then, because there's nothing that can fit. Right? Nothing can go there. So maybe that has to go there then, because that's the only thing that can go in the middle and save and save and save those spots. Hold on. So facing down. It can't go there, can't go there, can't go there, can't go there, can't go there. Okay, so facing left, it can't go there, could go there. No, can't go there, can't go there. Okay, so it has to go like this, or it has to go like this. I have a feeling it has to go like this because then, like, do we do we have enough space on the grid, even, with that? Like, that can't go there. Yeah, it has to go there. All right, so that goes there, and I'm guessing that does go there. And it just doesn't use all the spaces on here. Um... That has to go there, I'm guessing, because there's nothing else that could go in there, and I don't think I don't think we we have that much space. So what's where does where can this go now? There or there, either side. 
So no matter what, this is on the bottom and taking up a huge amount of space on the bottom. Okay. And I'm guessing this one has to go down here too. Does that fit? That, fit, that has to be right. All right, there we go. Nice, all right, cool. Good, they're all in place now. Oh, the bottom compartment opens. No, trash disposal room. Max out the needle. All right. All right, that doesn't help me, Merrick. It says max out the needle, needle, hmm. Diana, is there a needle over there? A needle? No, I don't think so. Oh, but there's a needle over on the meter. Which meter? Uh, I think it's for a thermometer, I see. Okay, uh, so let's heat up the coin. 188 pounds, what does that mean? It's probably thought it was a coin to be some needle. No. I thought the thermometer would be reading the temperature inside the incinerator. Maybe we have to give uh, give Phi the uh, the blowtorch? Let's see, if it lets us then that's for sure. Phi, I'm dropping the gas torch into the dust chute, please take it. Okay, so that's it for sure, okay. So whatever I can send through is one way, so that's that. Got it. All right. Small gas torch, fight fire with fire, they say, as if, as if like this tiny torch will outburn an incinerator. All right, so where, where, what are we doing? There's only trash in here and the stench is, let's burn it, let's do it. Feel the burn. If the thermometer on that side is connected to the one here, then when I heat it up. Oh, okay. I thought that was linked to the uh, to the thing and said the temperature is going up. I wonder how much heat I need to max the needle over there out. Hey, fire. Are you okay? Huh? Well, I'm not baking yet. Did something happen? The needle on the thermometer here is shooting up. Is it getting hot in there? No, I'm fine. It's just me. I see. So it is connected to the thermometer outside. So I'm so glad, huh? The coin here is... We got the coin. All right. Oh, the coin came off. The front fell off. 777. Seven, seven. Okay. This looks like just like a regular coin. I doubt there's anything to it, but I bet we can use it for something. All right. Let's put the coin in... The, uh, this thing over here. It's a keyhole with stop written above it, but it doesn't look too big for a key. Put a coin in there. No, that's not it. Okay, I don't know where the coin goes then. I'm, I've tried one thing and I'm fresh out of ideas. Could we use the coin to unscrew it? Oh, oh, okay, of course we could. Yes, they're off. All right, seems like we didn't need a screwdriver after all. All right, cool. We removed the cover, but should we really up and press this button so carelessly? Yes. I like... I'd like for a tiny guillotine to come out when you push it and chop off your hand. What? Wrong game. I'm going to forget you said that. Thank you very much. I'm pushing it. I don't like it when people pronounce guillotine as guillotine. I don't like guillotine. Yeah, there we go. Chat saying it. Guillotine just sounds wrong. It's guillotine, man. Fuck your guillotine. It's guillotine. I'm just not going to say the L's, says the man who had a D&D &D character where he, with silent L's. Oh good, my hand's still intact. Something came out of the floor. What is it? It kind of looks like a chair from me. To me, sorry. This is a chair, isn't it? We should try sitting on it. What? Hey, don't be hasty. Alright, we're doing it. Nothing's happening. I see, it's harmless. Why is it here then? Well, it's, she's not big enough. You have to sit in it. Do you want to try it out too? It's a little hard though. Eh, sure. Maybe we can figure out figure something out by sitting on it. Uh, Lamayo got him. What? What the hell? I can't, I can't move. Incineration in three minutes. What? Hey Sigma, Diana. What the hell's going on? I think we tripped something. I'm restrained, but Diana's fine. What did you say? No, no. Why did it? It was fine when I sat on it. So what? Wasn't it the? Didn't the gun have stop on it? Do I put the gun in there? Take a deep breath, Diana. We can get past this if we can just deal with it calmly. Right, okay, hold on. I'll find a way to get the two of you out. I'm counting on you. Five first. She doesn't have much time left. Oh, convenient. Okay. Don't forget to look behind you. The box that hung from the ceiling dropped. All right. Cool. Man, what a chad. Holy crap. This was hanging from the ceiling. I could maybe use the gun if I can get it out. Okay. Use the bottom of the screwdriver that was the same shape as that? Do I give that to Phi? 
Oh, we could hang it by the chain down and then she could do it and then we could pull it back up. And he kills hexagonal. Oh, the time is. All right, first of all, let's go talk to Sigma. How's it going, Sigma? And now Sigma's trapped too. Oh, what should I do? Stop focusing on me, Diana. I'm only being restrained. Fine, she doesn't have much time. You're right, I need to stop that. Oh, uh, wow, your chest is strong. Satisfied? I gotta stop. What are you doing in my face? I'm sorry, I just thought maybe there's something. If you have time to mess with people's faces, then go search some. some oh, it's location sensitive? What are you doing? Uh, I just thought maybe an important clue would be hidden somewhere. Well, there is something important there. Oh my god, I'm sorry, it's not like that. I didn't mean it's not like that. It is like that. It is like that. Oh, if I hold on hold on to the chain and drop this down, I'll be able to pull it back up. Fi, I'm dropping the box down. Could you open the lock for us? Alright, I'm on it. But how am I gonna open it? Let me just examine it first. Alright, it's definitely with the bottom of this, right? Use the grip like so. Yes, it's open. Diana, I open the lock. Pull the chain up. Got it. Pull chain up. I can get the gun. All right, now let's go shoot Sigma. A revolver. What should I do, huh? The muzzle. Maybe it'll fit. Wait, what? Uh, Diana, let me see the gun you got from the box. Huh, this? Hmm, you know what? The muzzle might fit the keyhole right next to me. Uh, I think it just might. Okay, I'll try. I think the gun will go in here. Please fit. Oh. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. It appears the preparations are complete. Zero. But first. I will tell you a story about the past. He's gonna take 17 you. years ago, a woman was killed. All right. As a result, after a falsely accused man was sentenced to death, his wife took her own life. A taxi driver died in an accident along with his passenger, a surgeon. Wait, hold on. This is just another part of the same story. Th this matters? The child who awaited a critical operation also perished. Everyone died. Six Ooh. Why did the six die? Because of a snail. Because of a snail. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> a single solitary snail took the lives oh. of six people. No, they didn't. So, snail is in the road one day, makes someone walk down a different part of uh, on their jog, or run, run down a different uh, road on their jog. That makes them die. Because they died, a chain of events were, were put in that made this happen. So how, how is that related to Zero? Zero is going for revenge. One of the killers is in here. Um... Something like that. No, it's, that, that, that. It has to be dumber than that. It has to be dumber than that. Like, the, the snail has to be more important. <laughs> there has zero underneath the uh, the plague doctor mask is actually a snail like like operating a very very complex machine uh, you know with, with a lot of levers involved you know like it's, it's actually a snail I, I, I don't know okay it's, I'm, I thought these were just stories to say life is unfair or whatever but okay let's see <laughs> Explain the rules. It should be clear that a revolver is set up beside the chair right now. Okay, is it loaded? It contains you... six rounds. Nah, it doesn't, though. Three are live, and three are blank, though they are randomized within the chamber. Pull the trigger, and the odds a live round will fire from the gun are six to three. to the incinerator. It automatically opens the moment it detects the sound of the revolver's discharge. Oh, why didn't we fire Five it? round or blank. It doesn't matter which is fired. Three minutes remain until the incinerator fires. What will you do? Pull the trigger or refrain. Both of their lives rest upon your decision. 
Okay, so 50-50 chance to save both or 100% chance to save one. Shit! God damn it! Wait, 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 no. There's no time, Diane. Hold on. That's wrong. 50-50 chance to save to save both of them, but one of them do nothing, both die, do something, one or both lives. So like you have to shoot. Like that's the only thing you do, right? Like do nothing, they both die. Or roll or flip a coin on if one dies or both die, right? That's got to be it. For whatever reason, I feel like I'm compelled to save it. But that's assuming that the rules are fair. Like, what if I don't do anything? Wrong. What do you mean? Why am I being Joe? Dot dot dot. Hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. My, where, where am I wrong? Where am I wrong? Okay. So there, my understanding is that there's a 50-50 chance that when she pulls the trigger, it's going to be a blank or a live round, and the gun has to be fired in order to to open the door, right? Like, if if we if we don't do anything, does the incinerator go off and then Sigma gets left out of the chair? Is that it? Is that why people are Joe dot dotting me? So like, it's either let Sigma live or flip a coin on both of them living. Okay. All right. Pull the trigger. What? Logically, which one has more to gain? If we don't pull that trigger, I'd obviously stay alive. My chance at survival would clearly be 100%. Okay. But then it guarantee Fi's death, as her survival rate would be zero. What happens if we do pull it then? The incinerator door would open, and Fi escapes. Chance of survival, 100%. And this choice still allows for the possibility that I may live. Yeah, I agree with him. Blank round. My head doesn't suddenly have a new hole. I mean, a blank is still it's gonna 50 do... 50. It's still gonna do something. So you understand, right? It's either 100 and zero, or 100 and 50. It's obvious which one is the wiser choice. How dare you not even consider everyone else's feelings, Sigma? Wait, hold on. Don't we have a box? Oh, it was made of glass. Oh, okay. We have something we can put in. She could put, like, her hand in it or, like, angle it so her shoulder's in it. And she could take a, bla a shot to the shoulder. And, like, it might soften it enough that it might... Like, you just put something in front of it for sure. For sure. There's, there are things you could do here. Oh. What if the shot is a live bullet? Do you really want Diana to end up blowing your head off with her own hands? Yes. But, Fi, if I don't pull the trigger, you'll... Don't worry about me. No. Diana, please, listen to me. What would be the most ideal outcome from this? Isn't it obvious? Isn't that obvious? That both of you stay alive. Yes. Okay, then think. Which one of those choices has that result as a possibility? If you don't pull it at all, one of us will definitely die. If you really want to save both of us. I'll have to pull the trigger. Diana, no! You shut up! <laughs> oh, started. begins in 20 seconds. Put your bracelet don't in front worry. of it. Just trust me. No, don't do it. How do I how do I pull? Oh. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. It's sad piano music. He's dead. Incinerator door is open. Incineration process terminated. No. It can't be. <gasps> he's actually dead. Wow. Why? Why did you do it? You murderer. Murderer!
Emperor! What the fuck, Fi? I, I didn't matter at all. Why are your eyebrows orange? I, I didn't. I didn't. So why? Why did you? Oh man, this is really sad. All right, let's reload. Let's reload. I don't. I don't like this. Let's reload. Let's go back. Quit. Quit. I'm a redditor. I'm reloading. I'm reloading. I don't. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Where is this one? Right. Let's reload. I'm reloading. Zero. There's no time, Diana. Pull the trigger. What? Logically, which one has more to gain? If we don't pull that trigger, I'd obviously stay alive. My chance at survival would clearly be 100%. But then it'd guarantee Fi's death, as her survival rate would be zero. What happens if we do pull it then? The incinerator door Let me open skip! No! Escapes. This this it's not chance funny survival, anymore! 100%. And this choice still allows for the possibility that I may live. Blank round. My head doesn't suddenly have a new hole. It's 50-50. So you understand, right? It's either 100 and 0, or 150. It's obvious which one is the wiser choice. How dare you not even consider everyone else's feelings, Sigma? Uh-huh. <laughs> what if the shot is a live bullet? Do you really want Diana to end up blowing your head off with her own hands? But... If I don't pull the trigger, you really did. Yeah. Oh, that's true. Oh, my bad. Don't sorry, sorry. I take it back. Me. I take it no. back. All right, Diana. Please listen to me. What would be the most ideal outcome from this? Isn't it obvious that both of you stay alive? <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, then think. Which one of those choices has that result as a possibility? If you don't pull it at all. One of us will definitely die. If you really want to save both of us. I'll have to pull the trigger. Diana, no! You shut up! Incineration begins in 20 seconds. All right, so this this isn't going to be... This isn't going to be anywhere near as funny as I thought it was going to be. Like, don't worry. Oh, oh well. Just trust me. Fucking like fucking like, four four minute joke. Four four minute joke. Please laugh. <sighs> Incinerator door is open. Incineration process terminated. Sigma? Oh, he's not dead? Sigma. Hey. Oh well, shit! Away. Now I have to reload to get the actual thing that really happened. And we have to sit through that again. How do I more ba Okay, let's just Oh, thank you. So, is it actually just 50-50? Or, because, no, it's not that I changed it by morbing because it was a reload. So, it's actually just 50-50? It's really a coin. Oh, that's cool. Oh, really? Wow. What am I eating? I'm eating a small Kit Kat. Sorry. Well, shit. Do it again so you get yeah i should yeah i want to do that um let me let me save it down here though sorry for eating on stream um
Are you hurt? Oh. Huh? Damn, my ears really hurt. They're killing me. Yeah, I'm not surprised. That might have ruptured my eardrum. you thinking Diana why did you pull that trigger we got lucky that it was a blank but if it'd been live then Sigma you hey, would have died it's all right everything turned out fine I agree there's no way I'll accept that the end justified the means you know she's consistent I'll Listen, give her that Sigma, consistently wrong Diana made the decision it was her choice to pull that trigger it was Joe actually that means she didn't care that there was a 50% chance you'd die. So, where are you going with this? <laughs> it was to save you. And she did. She saved your life. Hell, you should probably be thanking her. I didn't ask for any help. Never asked for this. We could climb up there now for announcing sure. announcing the current casualties. We on the moon again? Best, best, These best online. Three are now deceased. As a result, three X passes will be revealed. I kill fool. I yep. Kill fool. That is all. All right, now one of you say something about oh, Damn. you couldn't see her here. I can't believe it. So, because of the vote at thirteen thirty, they were executed. Not necessarily, but even Q. <sighs> he had to deal with a handicap. He probably didn't even realize something was wrong. Wait, what? Okay, again, what? Fi, what the fuck are you talking about? Uh oh. What's wrong? Diana! I have regret pox. I'm regretting my choice to say fi. Oh no. You too? Oh, there we go. What? What's happening? I think we were poisoned. Probably while we were asleep. Why? Who really cares right now? Oh, the dog! <laughs> Only need to save. Yeah, the dog. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Gab. Okay, what if we hadn't done that one? Would the dog not be here? Would it be locked? Wait. These are. Hello, Carlos here. Oh, now you can sit up. These are an antidote. Please drink them, Akane. We're. We're saved! <laughs> Gab, he brought us the antidote. No, it was a con! What the fuck? Come on! Let's drink these! What do you mean you drink? You seem just fine! Hold on. I hope we have really awkward gulping animations again. Stay on the note. These are the antidote. Please drink them. Akane. It's fine. It's from Akane. We can trust her. Can we? The handwriting is definitely hers. Okay. Carlos could have threatened her to write it. No, he would never do that. He's best boy. When we voted. Carlos chose Q Team. No, he didn't. Their note said that they'd vote for D Team. Then that whole note was a lie? Not necessarily. Maybe they died from something know. else, like you guys were just about to die. But it's not a stretch to imagine that Carlos intends to kill all of us. If we get knocked off, then C-Team can get out of here. So, you're saying that these aren't an antidote, 
but okay so so what do you think Fi? they knew that we were they knew we were gonna get poisoned and we knew that, they, that we were gonna be dying in there so what they did was that they sent they sent a fake antidote in a, in a dog with a note that was gonna get us to drink it so we would die even faster even though we we're about to die like like uh, whoa, whoa. It's, it's not enough that you were gonna die from poison i had to be the one to kill you actually you know what that makes sense for anime it wasn't enough that you were about to die. I have to be the one to do. Okay, you know what? I take it back. Fi has a point. Exactly. <laughs> poison. No. We're already I poisoned. Can't believe that. We already had a concoction pumped into our veins that's killing us. Why bother doubling down on the poison? Let's count on sixteen. <laughs> he said it. Regardless, <laughs> if we don't do anything, we'll. You choose, Diana. You saved all of us. Wait. Before. Is this an actual choice? I'll trust you to do it. But what? How? What? Is this a? What if? Is this random too? Is there a coin flip chance that it's double poison and the poison that we have right now is fake poison? Is this just choosing how to die? I'm. I'm fucking. I'm drinking. Trust in C Team too. <laughs> and that's how my story ended. I drank the double poison and died in 10 seconds instead of in 15. I should never have trusted that note that a dog brought. I still don't get it. Okay. What in the world is C Team thinking? Did they have a fight? <laughs> you mean. Akane and Carlos took opposite stances? That's the only explanation that makes sense. No one gives a fuck about Grumpy. Akane sent Gab with the antidote in order to save us. But that would have been an incredibly unfavorable outcome for Carlos. If that wasn't what he wanted, then he wouldn't have voted for Q-Team. Aren't you thinking too hard? I really doubt that Carlos intended for Q-Team to be executed. How can you be so sure? Well, he's an honorable firefighter who saves lives. <laughs> Simple-minded as always. <laughs> Fucking, like, like boundary-pushing physicist, chemist, biologist, roboticist, simple mind. Yeah, okay, fuck off, Fi. We've only known and lived with him for five days. Yeah, okay. How could we have any idea what he's thinking? No, it's not an issue of time. It's just not that easy to see a person's true self. You wanna know why they had to do this shit on the moon, moon fi? Because the moon's lower gravity meant that every single time that, that fucking Sigma went to a urinal, he didn't crack the floor below him and they had to replace it all the time, all right? That's how it was on Earth, all right? Think of who you're talking to, show show some respect. Come on. Even yours, Fi? Yeah. Does that mean you're hiding something from us? Who is Fi? Yes. We still don't know. What is it? Don't laugh, okay? My hair is actually red. What? <laughs> My hair is actually red. Yes. I said not to laugh. But, but I, so, I mean, it's a big deal for me, okay? I have a complex over it. It's it's actual plot. So that color. It's dyed. I figured I may as well make it something unique. Mr. Eyebrows. Well, I'm a redhead too. Yeah. You're being rude to Diana. <laughs> well, it looks good on her, of course. I mean, try to picture it. My face, but with red hair. What What's going on right now? Can uh -huh. we have questions? I think it'd be super cute. I think so too, yeah. Mm, not too bad. Not really, actually, though. It'd be a good look for you. Uh-huh. Okay, is that the end? That, we're done, aren't we? Oh, we're not. Okay. I also agree. It would be a good look. <laughs> 
<laughs> I can't finish it. <laughs> I can't finish it, I'm sorry. It's just too funny to me. <laughs> Go ahead, let's keep going. Oh, good. It seems you three are okay. Zero. It's good for you to rejoice while you can. You can look forward to a dark future ahead. What does that mean? Now it is time for you to sleep. All right. We're going to forget everything? When next you wake, know you will have no memory of these past 90 minutes. Oh, how many times has she told us about the red hair? Pleasant dreams. All right, what was that? Okay, so that was this down here. Gift from Gat, wait, what? Oh, gun versus incinerator. Oh my God, holy shit, that really matters. Like, pull it and he dies or don't do anything? Oh my God. And not take it at all? Okay. Um, I thought it would just be an ending. I didn't realize it was going to be like... Uh, or at least, I thought at least one of them would be an ending. Holy shit. Okay. Well, this is the one we're going with. I'm sorry. Like, I'm not going to go back and, and, and do the other one. Let, let's uh, let, let's come back to this later. Um, let's go back to, to, to Worst Team Q. I like the way we... Wait, what? That's red. Poison. Oh, shit. Oh, that's cool. Okay, um... If I hadn't done this yet, would the dog still have showed up? Or is that a spoiler? I, you know, I'm not gonna look at chat for that. I'm curious. Like, that, that's an end not taking the, uh... Not taking the poison that somehow counteracted the other poison. Um, oh, okay, that's cool. Alright, so that confirms that they're not all on the same route then. So, do we see one person from each route? So there's gonna be another one down here. Oh, so this necessarily might not be... So th this is, isn't is necessarily a continuation of this group with Sigma and or Phi dead. Or, or Phi dead, sorry. Like, this could be Q-Team down here, and we find out someone died, so we get some, some penalty, so we, we get something for it. That's interesting. All right. Yeah, this game's really cool so far. Why does everyone think it's the worst one? Like, structurally, this is almost maybe even just as interesting as VLR. I really like this. This is neat. Man, it, it must say something like One Piece sucks at the end or something like like don't don't you hate anime? Like like <laughs> Alright, let's go to worst team. Let's go back Ooh. to Q. <laughs> Alright, um We gotta do crossbow, right? What's crossbow? Let's do crossbow. Triangle. Triangle man, triangle man. Oh man, Mira. I'll go check out the other rooms. Um, Have fun. Where are the bunny ears? Hmm. 1810. Okay. I forget the time, so it doesn't really, really mean that much. Eric, why is he even bothering to look in the other rooms? We already searched through each one when we first woke up. Nothing. I don't think we've seen all of them. Uh, there was that one room we couldn't figure out how to get into. Oh, that's right. Was it on the ah! fake map? Oh, Eric's dead. That's good. Let's go! Any ball spot reason? Oh, someone did buy a marble! I'm sorry. Someone bought a marble yesterday. And I was supposed to do it at the beginning of stream, but... It Whoa, what the fuck is this room? Hold on. Someone bought a marble. Who bought a marble? It's not letting me.
Okay, it's not letting me do it. Uh, did Dragon's Den update it? And I'll just go with Dragon's Den. Okay, so... Yandex X... Yandex Anime bought a marble that is... Higurashi All Seasons. Alright, I'm not committing to All Seasons. Give me a second. What, what the fuck is this shit? Higurashi. Higurashi when they cry. Alright, so if you're not, if you haven't been up to date on the marble thing, there is a, a race that we're doing, and you can pay a million mono coins to buy a marble. And then when, when, and that also contributes to starting the races. When we get all of them, uh, when the race starts, I will be racing marbles to see what anime I'm going to watch. And I will report back, and if I can do a watch along on Twitch, I will do it. Higurashi when they cry, Wikipedia. Okay. Uh, Japanese murder mystery, Dojin soft visual novel. Sit what? Oh, is there like is this is the visual novel? Is there an anime? Anime adaptation. Excuse me. Okay, what is it about? It's a sound novel, a variation visual novel with the focus on sound and atmosphere. Oh man, that must have kept the budget down. Takes place in a fictional village of Hina Mizawa in June 1983. That's oh, older than I am. Shortly before then, the main character, something Meibara, moves to the village and befriends classmates. Ah, oh, for classmates? F you know what? I don't give a shit. All right, th that seems like it can go on there. All right, I'll put that on there. Thank you for buying a marble. Whoa! How crazy is this? I was tapping spots on the wall in the hallway when you screamed. You opened some kind of secret door. You did good. I'm impressed. Oh. oh wow! This room has a whole lot of books. You like to read? No. Do you like to read? Oh, we're eleven. Okay. Um, I don't know. Come on, you're talking about yourself here. I don't know. Uh, do I like to read? So, what is this room anyway? A study? Though it's practically an entire library. Seems like someone was just here. Uh, who? The only one who can wander freely would be... Right. It's got to be Zero. Eric, did you hear something so learn you here? Means... This is Zero's study? If it is, then there's got to be some sort of clue. Oh, Eric is Something Zero. about who Zero is, or how to get out of this crazy place. If anything was hidden in here... Alright, this one looks Those difficult. Those safes would be the best bet. Let's start looking. This safe is big. I wonder what's inside. Maybe Zero's hiding in there. Honestly, yeah. Haha, <laughs> that's hilarious, Mira. Huh? It was a joke, right? No, it couldn't be possible. It's open. Okay. Keyhole. It's so big. We'll definitely know the key for this when we see it. Alright. Will we? These four figures are all posed differently. Is this Zero's collection? I can't say I understand his taste. <laughs> they look decorative. Maybe they mean something. All right. I was gonna say that one kind of looks a little bit like a four and that one could be kind of like a six. But then these don't look like anything, so I guess not. Maybe they're just decorative. Okay. Is there a dra anything in the drawer? Ah, a key. It's got some kind of mark on it. Maybe I can. It can open up. Open one of the safes here. This key has a human mark on it. A human. I wonder what it means. Okay. I don't know. A human. I don't know what that is. What's a human mark? 
Fountain pen, and that's it, a pen. Something written here, but the ink is all blurry. I can't make it out. Oh, that wasn't part of the, the texture. That's how it is. If we can't read it, then we may as well look elsewhere. This is the paper organizer, isn't it? Maybe there's a clue, huh? It doesn't open. Convenient. Okay, like, this is kind of awkward to, like, move around. Th this is it? This is the fo the focal point of the, of the thing? Is is this desk that we kind of, like, clip through? Someone were the only ones in this ward. The only person left would be... Anyway, I don't think anything here on the desk is important. An ashtray, no ashes. There's no trace of it ever being used. Maybe the room's owner doesn't smoke. It's a decorative. Everything in here is decorative. Bottle of ink. Eric, be careful that you don't spill it, okay? Why? I'm... Hey, I'm not that clumsy. Whoa, th that was close. Ha, 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 ha. Ha, ha. Is that a feather duster? Yeah, this is a feather duster. I've never used one of these before. Can't say I've ever even seen one. Some of the things in this study are so old-fashioned. All right. Nope, this key won't fit. Maybe it needs to be a different key. All right, so th the key that matches the... So what the fuck? Evil Grumpy Carlos Kendall that actually fits. Okay, so Fi Carlos Akane Jumpy Q Q again Eric Eric's a baby Diana Sigma Mira, maybe? I don't know how to say this word. This Russian doll, is this me? Is this me? Why Why is it sucking on a pacifier? Damn you, Zero. This doll, is it Jumpy? It's all battered, but it feels like him. Ah, symbolism. This is Jumpy? He's kind of scary. No, it's Grumpy. This is Fi? Ah, yep, yeah, they have the same look in their eyes. So this is Fi. She's a opposable paper doll. Does that mean she's thin? She kind of looks like uh, Chad Ketchy. This doll kind of reminds me of Carlos. It looks solid and, well, blonde. So this is Carlos. He looks strong. This is just the perfect Carlos. This doll kind of reminds me of Akane, but... What are these things called again? Those? Aren't they cat girls for male fantas- Oh, I know. I think it's called Mo. Akane is so cute. That's it. This looks like Diana. Actually, it looks exactly like her. Does it? This is a doll made of bisque porcelain. Ah, so this is Diana. This looks like Sigma. Haha, <laughs> I suppose you could say they look exactly alike. So this is Sigma. Does this mean he's got a strong jaw since it's a nutcracker? Is this me? It looks like one of those dress-up dolls. Alright, well, this is fun. Oh man, Ace would be here like looking at this going, who the fuck are these people? Alright, uh, maybe the correct set of letters will open it. Five letters, okay, let's do this. Oh no, I got an idea, punching all five letter words you can think of. We don't have time for that, idiot, besides, who's, who says that'd be an actual word? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't really think, okay, wh what, what are these? I'm gonna have trouble reading this now. Uh, I have no fucking clue. K? What are the options? It can't. It can't do the whole alphabet from from that, right? Assuming this is even it. Okay. All right. Fuck me. I guess. All right. I have no clue what this is. Alright, let's go. This safe and this key have the same mark. I hope this opens the safe. 
Yeah, it opens. Good job. Now see what's inside. Is that a gun? D. Let's look apart for something. What do we need it for? The letter D is engraved on it. It means you're my darling. Aw. That's nice. Star mark key. This key has a star mark on it. Where did we see this star mark before? Handgun. It's a handgun. This model can use larger rounds. Doesn't the recoil knock you over? That's a common thought, but if you use the correct stance, it's not a problem. What? I see. You two sure know a lot about guns. All right. Birdman card. HFGY. All right. Maybe this is nothing. Don't you think this chair is different from the other one? It's got a keyboard that's not responding. I bet the power isn't on. I don't see a power switch anywhere. Hmm, let's look around. Can we go up the stairs? Let's go upstairs. Oh, we can change. That's neat. Oh, all right. Here we go. There's a moon mark on this safe. And of course it's locked. Looks like we need a set of letters. All right, these figures are all over the room. I wonder if what they're for. Were they put here on purpose? You think? It could be some kind of hobby of zeros. All right, that's another one. What the fuck is this one? Just I? This is each polyv Palovsian doll pose has a meaning. Right hand over chest means confirm. Crouching with hands on knees means deny. A doll in the deny pose indicates the meaning is the opposite. For example, NIL changes to exist. What? What what in the tunic is this bullshit? What do you Nil as in, like, nothing means exist? Okay, how do I know the normal meanings? Okay. Nil. It's not working. It's not working. That's not it. Ace. Oh, I did the button. Oh, oh, okay, sorry. I didn't realize that. I thought it was just decorative. Oh man, good thing chat was here. Huh, it worked. Fantastic, how you know the answer? It was just a coincidence, wasn't it? He's the, the one most surprised out of all of us. Well, it worked out anyway. Let's open it up and see what's inside. This is part E. This is a strange part. The letter E is engraved on it. Yes, Mira, you make me feel excited. All right. What's he going to say for A? I want to grab your uh, crossbow. It's silent and easy to use. Does that mean it's good for assassinations? Yes. Don't say scary things like that. You just, you know about guns. Sun card, nil. Okay. All right, so I'm guessing that the other one is exists then, because nil turns into exists, and he was crouching over it. I guess nil. Okay. I'm not understanding this at all. This is so amazing. It goes on forever. It's like book heaven. This is no time to wax poetic. Let's search the room. That does look really fucking cool. I'm not gonna lie. Exist. Oh, you can drag. Cool. Awesome, now we can open the safe. Let's see what's inside. 
And now to see what looks, see what kind of treasures are contained within. What is this? Can't say that looks like a treasure to me. Part F. Oh man, what are you gonna say? We can just use this part for letter F is engraved on it. You're soft like a feather in my arms. Yeah, you redditor. What's this lever? Wrong lever. It's hidden away in the safe, so my bet is this for something important. Really, then let's pull it. All right. Still need a key. Did we use this key yet? The star key. Oh no, we didn't. All right, let's do it. No, the, the safe. The safe. The safe. There we go. This safe and this key have the same mark. I hope this opens the safe. Yes, it opened. Time check what's inside. All right, is this the? F no, only two of them had a weapon. All right, C. It's a part to something. Letter C is engraved on it. What does it mean? It means you're hella cute. It means you're cutie full of tra Yeah, there we go. Moon card. Nil. All right. Note. S O two sixteen. All right. Don't know what the fuck that means. Okay. There's no spot for a key in this safe. How are we supposed to open it? These cracks are pretty big. Maybe we can just break it open. How exactly? It's not a piggy bank. Use the crossbow. There's some huge. Let's use the gun. Gun's powerful. Yes, but not powerful to break it open. Ah, I see. It's and here I was thinking it was a good idea. All right, let's use the crossbow. Right, I guess even Eric can figure this one out, huh? What's that supposed to mean? Wait, Mira, hey. This crossbow isn't gonna break open the door. We need to figure it out another way. All right, let's just throw Eric into it. I don't give a shit about Eric. Oh, I think the power's on now. What's the keyboard for? Let's try putting something in. Uh, shit, S-O whatever. I was informed that Bikoi has a a uh, pointed nose. Does it point to the right or to the left? It's to the right, right? A pointed nose like that. All right, there you go. I have fixed. I have fixed the nose. All right. Pointed. We use some Bikoi juice for that. It was worth it. All right. It was. It was la Oh no! Ruined forever. How could I do such a thing? S O two sixteen. All right. S O two sixteen. Yay, I knew this code would go here. So now what? Oh, now there's gonna be a gun on you. Hey, you okay? That chair startled me when it went up so suddenly. Yeah, it scared me too. You were worried about me, Eric? No, I wasn't. What was up there anyway? Oh yeah, I think the number we put in is probably a book's number. I see, entering the correct code makes the chair go up, go up to get the corresponding book. So we were lucky this time and got the right number. What book did you get? Uh, it's more a piece of paper than a book. It looked like a book to me. There are additional poses for the Polatsian dolls. From left to right, right hand raised is the grass dance. Move three down. Oh, fuck. Oh, Fuck. Right hand raised is the grass dance. Move three down. Their right or the right that we are looking at it. Left hand raised is the sand dance. Move five down. Left hand extended out is the wind dance. Move seven down. These poses are used as a communication method with distant friends to indicate a change of date or order of letters. Okay, so we have to change the, the numbers or letters in the code that we just did Three do we have to do this three down five down and seven down? Three five and seven So s would be one two three 
Uh, it was O2. Okay, what, where does O2 go? Does it does it loop back down to like 90 something? Five down, so it'd be 97. And 16 would be 10. No, I didn't think so. Okay, maybe I did it wrong. It says error. How do you know the code you're entering? You should search this room. Okay, so maybe maybe I did the code wrong or um, I made a mistake, but let's keep going. What's the cylinder? There's a bird. No, wait. More like a birdman mark on the side. It's a cryptex. It opens with a specific set of letters. We have to match four, huh? Let's try. Check. Damn, how could it not be that? Huh, that's wrong. Wait, didn't we see some kind of bird mark somewhere? Yeah, we got the card with the same mark. I think they're connected. Alright, um... HFGY. Is it just that? HFGY. H... F... G... Why? Oh, it's wrong. I do think that bird mark is connected, though. The card is four letters, but it doesn't make any sense. Speaking of sets of four, do you think the four figures on the table? Oh, no! They're in the sand dance, grass dance, and wind dance poses according to the paper. What do those dances mean? It says shift three, shift five, shift seven. Shift, what exactly do we shift? There are four of them, so we should look for four. Okay, so. Three, what is it again? So it's three. Three, five, seven, three. Three, five, seven, three. Is that it? Three, five, seven, three. Three, five, seven, three. Three, five, seven, three. They're in that order, right? Three, five, seven, three. So it would be H down three, um, F down three, down five, uh, or it was a G. H, F, G, Y. All right, so H down three, F down five, G down seven, Y down three. So A would be, uh, sorry, Y would be A, no, Z, A, it would be B. B, so it end with a B. Three, so I put H, F, G, Y in, and then I have to remember three, five, seven, three. H, F, G, Y. H, F, G, Y. All right, now this down three. One, two, three, right? One, two, three. Now this down five. One, two, three, four, five. It's K. This down seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And this down three. One, two, three. No. All right, is it is it up instead? Am I shifting it the wrong way? I thought that would be right. HFGY. Alright. So I'm moving it down the other way. Okay. Down three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. It's looking good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And one, two, three. Easy. Okay, so they're not in that, they're not in the order that they said, or I misunderstood it. Okay. Alright, so these two are the same, but the other ones. Okay, so let's see. Um, Let's look at the file. Fuck me for thinking that they were describing them in that order. Okay, so from left to right. So this is the first one, and that's the one that's repeated. That's five. So the corresponding ones are five, and the one... So it's five, five, three, seven, five. Five, three, seven, five, right? Five, three, seven, five, right? Five, three, seven, five. Five, three, seven, five. Five, three, seven, five. All right. 
and it's H F G Y. H F G Y five three seven five five three seven five H F G Y five three seven five. Okay, and is it like moving down makes me think this down, right? That's right, right? Down, down further in the alphabet, right? So down five. One, two, three, four, five. All right, three. Five three seven five. One, two, three. All right. Five three seven five. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Mind. All right, we got it. Okay. That wasn't so bad. All right, it opened. I knew this was the right answer. Part B. A strange part. It's not really useful right now. The letter B is engraved on it. It's it's gotta mean you're so beautiful. Shut up. All right, let's combine some shit. It won't let us. Okay. Note two. Bullet for C team. Arrow for Q team. Acid for D team. All right. So it's a bullet for C team. How about we shoot them? I know they're just pictures of, of dolls, but it still feels kind of wrong. Um. Oh no, we fucked it up. Ah, the pictures were reset. How? Must have shot the wrong person. Going by the note. How? We have to shoot C team with bullets and Q team with arrows. Oh, all of C team. Um, uh, Kane and Grumpy. All right, we followed the note and put bullets in C team. I guess arrows are up next. Do we have infinite bullets? Okay, arrows. Q team. Who's Q team? Us, right? All right. Yeah, I think we did it. Shooting pictures of us as dolls feels worse than I thought it would. We finished, so don't dwell on it. Come on, look, there's something behind it. All right. Someone's, someone's here. What? It's another gun. It's Oh, it's an, a grenade launcher. What, what in the Resident Evil, man? A grenade launcher. Just holding it makes me want to blow something up. I think I know the feeling. Blowing a huge hole in the wall just feels good, you know? I'm sure it's fun, but please control yourselves. Okay, that's how we open the, gra the, the glass. Here we go. With the grenade launcher. Maybe it has acid grenades. Grenade launcher. This thing will blow that safe store to pieces. Hold on a second. We'll be in pieces too if you fire that thing here. He's right. We don't even know how much firepower it has. Then how about we shoot it from the second floor? Come on. That's got to be far enough. Okay. Well, I guess it's a little better to shoot it from here. Fire in the hole. Wait, we haven't checked to see if it's really safe. Oh my god. Oh my god, I didn't think it'd be that powerful. That's why I said to wait. We're just lucky we're all okay this time. I think the door broke open. Everything is fine, so let's just go back downstairs. Wow, it's really in pieces. Let's see what's inside. I hope nothing's broken. It's just more of the fucking dolls. Oh my oh. Okay. These figures are inside the safe, and they're all in the same pose. It must be important somehow since they were locked in the safe. Hey, there's something else in here. What pose is that again? That's the seven pose, isn't it? Or is it the... Th I guess we'll find out in a second. Part A. It's a strange part. What can we use it for? The letter A is engraved on it. What does it mean? I think... I think it means you're adorable. Oh, it's the seven. So it's seven, seven, seven. The lucky number. J0503. And we have to put these down seven each, maybe? Eh? J0503. J0503. No? 
That's strange. I put J0503 in it in right, didn't I? Hey, do we find a note in the safe we blew up? Huh, you know what? There was something else in there. Alright, is it? Let's try again. One, two, J0508. Oh, it's 0503. 0503. And they're this one, right? The Wind Dance 7. So, 7 down. So, is it just reduce them by 7 and it goes up to 99 or something, or what? That seems really unintuitive to me that it would go down to 99 like it would it would overflow that doesn't make sense to me is it just zero 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 because you're minusing seven from it that doesn't seem right j would be one two three four five six seven q and then zero 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 no all right so oops error so q Oh, uh, it's 0503, right? O five O three. So that would be ninety-eight and ninety-six, right? That can't be it. Let's try it. No. Okay, what about the other way? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, that would be 13 and 10, right? It's 05 and 03. Okay, that's not it either. Did I add it wrong? Oh, it's 12 and 10. It's 12 and 10. It's 12 and 10. Let's try it again. Q, 12 and 10. All right, there we go. So you have to add it instead of go instead of subtracting? That's kind of weird. It says down. I mean, I guess I got there pretty quickly. So just by process of elimination, it's fine. Oh, it worked. Okay. Have a safe trip. Just kidding. Make sure you get whatever's there. Same place. Woo, that was scary. I almost fell out of the chair. I don't really see I see a need to have this device though. Why not just move the like going from the same with the letters was the same as, as the cylinder puzzle. So you go down there but up on the that uh yeah, whatever. Maybe it makes sense under some context. I don't really see the need to have this device though. Why not just move move the books? Did it say something about it was dates and it was showing like a change of date? So maybe it's just about moving forward. And down is there as a kind of like different way. Eh, maybe it does make sense. I know that zero, that zero is super weird, right? So what did you get? Oh, this. What's this? F, E, D goes in C, B, A. A plus B, C plus D, E plus F, A, B plus C, D, A, B, C, D, E, F. Cool. All right. All right. Well, I'm not fucking with that, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna throw them together if that's okay with you. Where's B? Okay. And then these two get combined. All right, and then these two get combined. No, uh, these two get combined. All right, and then these get combined. What a puzzle. All right, what the fuck is this thing? This looks kind of cool. It's alive, so what is this thing? 
Maybe it's a key. Even if it is, it's way too big. Oh, it's the key for the huge safe. Oh, that's, that's neat. So we just keep weapons now, huh? This key should fit right in. I hope we can find clues to who Zero is this time. Something awesome has to be inside a huge safe like this. Kill one. Yeah, it opened. Uh huh. All right, that room was okay. A little tedious. It was okay though. Uh, what does kill one mean? Must mean we have to kill someone. We have to. What the? Is that the freezer from the first Is game? Is that? Listen? No. Junpei. Oh. Um. What? Why do you have an axe to your own? No. Did Carlos just kill himself? How far down the flowchart so. are we? But why? I will lose my shit if this is like the first one of 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 the line. Maybe it had to do with Junpei's body. Carlos somehow still not CT. still alive. Carlos, Junpei. Ooh. DT, Diana, Phi, Sigma. Akane's still alive. These five are now deceased. As a result, five X passes will be revealed. Oh, we're getting out. Light, jump, blue, red, milk. That is all. I kill fool. Wait. Uh, it mentioned five people, right? Aside from us, Akane's left. But why in the world did D-Team... The execution. Back during the vote at 1330, D-Team was... <sighs> well, the reason why isn't the issue. What's important is the reveal of five X-Passes. In other words... If one more person dies... Oh, well, this is perfectly timed. What the hell? Um, the granny launch is gonna kill everyone, Eric. You're dumb. Hey, guys, we should stay calm. Wait, why is Mira pointing at Eric? Aren't they a couple? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> now, let's just put these weapons down. Put yours down first. What, what are you saying, Eric? If, if I put mine down, then you'll... Huh? Look over there! Why, Mira? We're in love. Aren't we? Nah. Um, Eric, this will be hard for you to hear, but I think you might be mistaken about that. You're lying! <laughs> then why is a gun pointed at you right now? No, it's not what it looks like, Eric. What is it? What is it then? I love you with all that I am. But I can't kill a kid. Mira. So you know what you need to do, right? Huh? You don't get it? Uh, um. Oh, 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 she's great. Oh, man. Oh, man. Best girl. Oh, 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 man. What do you mean? God, how dumb can you get? Mira, this isn't you trying to get Eric to kill me, is it? No. Nope. Don't be stupid. Not even I have a little this bit. I gun pointed at him so that I can protect you, of course. If I drop my weapon, then Eric will. Then Eric, how about you putting yours down first? No way. Not happening. If I put this down, you'll definitely kill Mira. There's no way I would. How would I know? What proof do I have that you won't up and fire that thing? We aren't getting anywhere like this. If just one more person dies... Who are you talking to? One more person. One more. Just one more.
why why do I have to why do I have to type it? Okay, hold on. Uh Akane. Cannot get towards C. Oh. Junpei. The dead cannot be killed. Uh, Gab. He is not here. Oh, that sucks. Um, zero. Do not know identity. Joe. Error. Uh... Seven. Error. Ace. Error. Alice. Error. Oh, she's already dead. He's surviving that. Are you for real? For real? <sighs> Gotta kill someone. <laughs> this is a joke, right? Mm, looks like it got you pretty good. You'd probably come out okay if we moved to help you right now, but... M Mira? Eric, I'm going to kill you. I... I see. Of course. You only need... one more. Do you have any last words? Mira... I... forgive... You. Wow. You look better when you smile. Yeah, better best to cut that off. Whoa, what's going on in the background there? Why? You're asking me that? You're the one who took the first shot. Y yeah. You're right. But. How, how can you be so calm about it? Calm? Oh no, I'm actually surprised right now. Oh. I had no idea his last words would be the same as my first. Your first? No, not that way. It's something else. Well, first of all, it's not as if I was actually dating. Um, what the fuck did she just mean by that? Oh, oh shit. Oh. I had no idea his last words would be the same as my first. Oh. Really? I thought... Okay, so my read on that right now is like she's saying, I had no idea his last words would be the same as the first person that I killed. The first person I killed had the same last words as as uh, as what he just said. I can't think of another way... May, uh... Like, I thought it was, like, his last words would be the same thing as the first thing he said to me. Like, the first thing he said. Because that, that's that's a, a thing that women hate to hear. You know, smile. You look better when you smile. Like, like bullshit like that. So, like, I thought it was that. That's what that's what it was. That's why I want to go back and see. But no, that that's not it at all. Unless it's, like, been translated kind of wrong. Like, that, that... That's how that reads to me right now. But it's not necessarily... Huh. Okay.
Okay, not confirmed, but that's very sus. Give her anything. I guess you weren't really in love then. Oh, I was. I suppose he thought we were, though. I'm in love with all my victims. I just let him go since it would have been a hassle. A hassle? What about how Eric feels? His feelings, huh? Oh, he's dead. He doesn't have feelings. I haven't really been able to understand emotions my whole life. Oh, better Anger, and better. I mean, more sadness, sus than sus. Pain, fear, and things like love. So when Eric said he liked me as much as he did, I didn't know why. I don't even really understand what he said before he died. Are you going to carve out his heart? Yeah? You you just going to do it, huh? We're just we're just heart carving after the heart carving story. We're just we're just Whoa. We're just going to town. What are you doing? You're the heart collector. I'm going to touch Eric's heart. Okay. All right. All right. Wow, how 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 fucking the speed run time savings I just did on that fucking deduction up there. So glad I stopped the stream to do that shit. You know. Oh wow, that's a that's a that's a cool hint. I wonder what that's gonna mean later. Oh no, oh she's carving out a heart. Oh okay, alright, never mind. Sorry, my bad. My Ever bee. since I was little, I've always been told I'm callous and unfeeling. So I like to touch people's hearts. Literally. Change. Oh for fuck's sake. What expressions were. I'd take a mirror and Amazing. Making them every day, but they've never quite looked right. One day my mother told me something. Deep inside a person's chest is an object called a heart. This heart controls their emotions and changes their expressions. I remember thinking, that's unfair. And I took it literally. Why was everyone hiding this important thing inside so no one else could see? I wanted to see what it looked like. I decided my first would be a woman. About the same age as my mother. Okay. I waited on an isolated street so there would be no bystanders. I also planted a snail. And then I stabbed her without warning with a small knife I brought with me. <laughs> I'd practiced on animals, but I was still surprised by how fast she collapsed. Why did you do this? I this, this is like eerily similar to, to, to a scene I wrote in a story once for a story that it, it didn't get released. Feel feel a little called called out by the game right now. I want to see what a heart is. I think I'm the only one who doesn't know. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Hey, that's where you hide it, right? I know where it is. Hurry up and show me. Okay. <laughs> I forgive you. So please, don't ever do something so terrible again. Can you do that? No, Lamayo. Is this the mirror Why? ending? Because smiles look better on you. Called it, man. I called it so early. Holy shit. Damn. Damn. Called it so so far in advance this reveal. Fucking wow. So impressed with myself right now. Fucking called it. Smiles? The woman didn't answer me. She was dead. Patted at her face for a long time. She didn't even blink anymore. Mm. When I gave up on waking her, I thoroughly searched for her heart. It took some time, but I soon felt an unfamiliar, warm, comforting sensation. I knew it. It was here. The last expression the woman formed on her face was a smile. Well, that's when I realized that this kind of moment was when you should smile. Status. I began to hunt for that. Reaching out and touching heart after heart. Oh my god, I, my status is I really I need to pee. I terrible at it first. I barely touched hearts and always badly. <laughs> but after doing it over and over again, <laughs> I eventually got better at it. Fear, <laughs> hatred, sadness. I learned about so many emotions by touching hearts. And there was always new expressions to see. 
But unfortunately, after oh, that first... This is the best game. I was never able to find that comforting heart. This is just the best game. This is exactly I what I wanted. I wanted to feel that warmth one more time. I wandered aimlessly, searching to find someone who held that same warmth. And that was how one day, I came across Eric. Okay. Oh, he was still working going. at an ice cream shop. Oh, of course he was. With one glance. I could tell he was useless. No talent, no worth, nothing. I've seen many hearts of those like him, but none held my interest. Naive, helpless weaklings. It's as if they're amusing creatures simply there to be exploited. That's all I saw them as. But Eric. Something felt different with him. Okay, you're picking up the gun, right, Q? I stopped by the shop several times to watch him. I just had to figure out how he was different from all the others. I tried talking to him. So hold on, is is he different in a way that you actually genuinely liked him or something and you didn't understand how that was? I don't... Like, what, okay, okay, whatever, let's keep going. I spent time speaking with him, going places together to learn how he reacts. But I still didn't know. At one point, I thought I'd made a mistake. But... Oh, this... This is it. I knew Eric would be different. I had a hunch when I first met him, and I was right. He doesn't have a heart. I told you, didn't I? And his last words were exactly the same as my first. Yeah, paraphrasing. How incredible is that? Oh, oh, this person really, truly loved me. All right, are you going to eat it now? So this is love. Oh, Stardew, level now up! announcing the current casualties. C-Team, Carlos, Junpei. Q-Team, Eric. D-Team, Diana, Bye. Okay, so. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, alright, alright, alright. Let's drop a knowledge bomb on chat right now. Okay, that was very dumb. Okay, that was very, very dumb. Really, really dumb, really stupid, really dumb, really stupid. However... She's crazy. She's crazy. It's dumb and she's crazy. She's sick. She has something very wrong with her. It's it's dumb, but she's crazy, okay? Like in the other games, it's dumb and it's not meant to be. <laughs> okay? Like in the other games, it's dumb and it's like and they're super smart geniuses fucking whatever, you know what I mean? Like like this this is she's crazy, dumb, sick, twisted, you know? So, you know, it's not Sigma. These six are now deceased. As a result, six X passes will be revealed. Okay, do we get to leave? Fight, jump, pour, blue, red, milk. I don't understand the, the X passes. Milk. All right. I just noticed. Covered in blood. I think that's an anagram. All right. An anagram. You switch the letters around to get a different meaning. Okay. The truth is invisible. So that's what it changes to, huh? What do you think it means? Hmm. I'm not really sure. Maybe it's similar to a human heart. You can't see it because it's hidden inside your chest. All right, should I put them in? Yeah, go ahead. Oh shit, I didn't... M milk? Oh, for fuck's sake, I don't, I didn't, I didn't know I was supposed to keep track of them. Are they in, are they somewhere in the file? 
Oh, the, the, the archive. All right, here we go. Fight, jump, pour blue, red milk. Fight, jump, pour blue, red milk. Fight, jump, pour blue, red milk. Fight, fight. Jump. Pour. I, I just made something up, didn't I? Oh, no, it is pour blue, red milk. Pour blue, red milk. Okay. Blue. Red. Milk. What about I Kill Fool? Alright. This was a short game. Gab doesn't judge. Okay, let's go. What about Akane? Akane's yeah. not here. It's a different time. It's the same building you can use three times. I'm sure of it. I want to see the map again because I, I have a hunch that there's a clue on the map and it's just not fucking showing it. Oh, it's credits time. Map is in the files? Alright, we'll look. Oh, okay, cool. Alright, so is that it done? Like, there's no there's no post-credit thing? Will it, this is a bad end? Okay, that, that sucks. What is love? Don't hurt me. Achievement unlocked. Great. Q and one. Okay. So that's the first Q end. What is love? Okay. Crossbow. Okay. Okay, kill, kill Eric, shoot Eric, shoot Mira, shoot nobody, no, that's gonna be one of them, shoot, shoot yourself, shoot nobody, that's gotta be it, right? Nobody. Alright, I kinda wanna go and do this and see what they all are right now once we got this ending. This seems like something we should do. Um, yeah, let's go back. Three-way standoff. Okay, someone said that there's the map in the file. Cinema. I'm not seeing a map. It's in cinema. Oh, right. Okay. I want to I want a, a bigger map. Oh, there's like extra stuff here. Technically, RL6 did not kill 6 billion people. The spreading of the virus caused chaos and panic around the world, promoting the explosion of several several nuclear reactors. It is these those explosions which led to the 6 billion deaths. All right. Crash Keys, a secret organization created by Akane Kirishiki. Their ultimate goal is to create a better future. Akane's brother, Aoi, is second in command and is assisting her from outside. Oh, oh, is he? Okay, cool. Of course he is. Hello, Carlos here. Got it. Okay, so these are the maps. So this is that one, right? What one are we in? Q. Where was, uh... Okay, yeah, for sure. Look, look at this shit. All right, like if you if you turn them, am I wrong? 
if you t look see how this goes straight up and there's gap here right and if you look at this one here it goes straight up and there's a gap here right and if you look at the other one with with this one like that that like loops around and slots right in perfect the pod room slots in perfectly into this part here am i wrong wait am i what, what lounge the angle there to the I think that fits, doesn't it? Oh, maybe it doesn't. Shit, there would have to be like a gap right here. Is there nothing there on this on this one? Oh, there isn't. Yeah, that kind. Of, uh, yeah, oh, I'd have to overlay them. Is it? Decontamination room vent. Power room. Uh, okay, I'm I'm not 100% convinced, but I think so. I think so. I think so. I think so. Anyway, um, what? Someone want me to check status. Dead. De oh, this is the shit on here. Okay, that would be why. All right, Q. Neat. Are they always like this, or no? Or are they just in this room? Neat. Man, Akane looking super uh, not cute, huh? All right, uh, I'm gonna go pee. Uh, I think we're gonna go um, Mira now, and then and then uh, ourselves, and then nobody. But I'll be back in. Um, I'll be back in like five minutes. Go brush your teeth.
All right, did you all brush your teats? So it seems to me that Mira is somehow her her killing that person set off a chain of events. Is it just happenstance or it seemed to be like it, 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 because of that something else happened because of that something else happened and then a child died. Is this something to do with trying to save the child? Like, is Zero trying to do what they did in the first game? How would that work? Then I, I guess that would make Mira the most important person here then, to try and make Mira more back and and not do it. Because if Mira was the one that... No, no, no. It's probably going to be... Carlos is the most important because he's the one that put the snail in the, in the, in the path somehow and Carlos has to more back and not put that snail there. That's probably it. I don't fucking know. Let's see what happens. Or the snail needs to more back. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. No, you won't. Oh. Okay. Are we gonna get the exact same thing now? Uh, Eric. Jiggle. Why? <laughs> Mira. No, not there. If you do it there, then his heart will be gone. Your heart. I have to. Hey. Don't make that face. Smiles. Look better. On you. Ugh, what a waste. What? See what you went and did? Uh, no. I, I just. I just. And lest we forget, you tried to kill me, didn't you? Nah. Better not try to weasel out of this. Okay. Is she even capable of zipping that up? Now announcing the current casualties. C team, Carlos, Junpei. Q team, Q, Eric. D team, Diana, Bai, Sigma. These seven are now deceased. Uh huh. It's a little suspicious. We're not seeing the blood on the from the Jeez. kid. This couldn't have ended any shittier. Uh-huh. Mira. Wait, what? Okay, so we're like a robot for sure, right? Gotta go back in time. Achievement unlock game over. Ooh. Okay. Gotta go back in time. Okay, so I'm guessing all of these are going to be like that. Okay. 
This is actually really good. So, right? I know. Like, like seriously, like what she just did is stupid and it's dumb. Oh, my mom told me to go touch hearts and I took it literally. I, wow, I'm such a psychopath. But she's crazy. She's insane. Like, it's not like, oh, take this seriously. It, it, it was a bunch of geniuses made a clone army and brother and the kid was named left. And oh, oh God. And we sent him to the moon and oh, oh, oh. like that. That's bad and stupid. But it's meant to be like, haha, this is a good part of the story. Yeah, characters acting normally. Like she's, she's in fucking insane and it's dumb like I'm not saying it's good or anything but still it's, you know at, at least it's it's dumb and it's got a good reason for being dumb um, all right I'll just slowly put my weapon down first so now you dumb characters doesn't make bad writing okay okay there can be bad there can be dumb characters in fiction though for sure Carlos is one of them and I love him <laughs> you too yeah okay Sure. All right. <laughs> you gonna shoot the grenade launcher and kill us all? Okay, you know we're all dead, right? Um. No. Um. <laughs> what an idiot. Now announcing the current casualties. C team, Carlos, Junpei. Okay, that was the stupidest thing that's happened so far. That was really bad. Q team, Q. D team, Diana, Phi, Sigma. These six are now deceased. As a result, six X passes will be revealed. How could you be so heartless, Eric? Let's go, Mira! Let's get out of here and build a happy home and wonderful future together. Yeah. Do you think he's actually hitting that or no? <laughs> Look, how far is she taking this experiment? Three days. Oh, this is still go. Th this one we see what happens outside. Okay. Man, I don't think I could be any happier. I have you, Mira. And this bed is super comfy. Okay. Ah, I couldn't ask for anything more. I think the heart's coming out. Isn't that right? Yeah, right. Ah, I hope we can be like this every day. Ah. Forever and ever and um. Okay, we we didn't really need that. Okay, but whatever. We didn't need that. I agree. I agree. Okay, uh, what's, what's Q's name? I'm guessing I can't guess it. What's the other option then? Do I have to learn the name and then come back? Or is there another option? What was it? Was it, it was nobody, right? What about everybody? No. Uh... This is very long. Eric and Mira. No. Both. 
of them. No. That's spooky, huh? Please input Q's name. All right. Q's name. No, I don't think this is going to work. All right. Can I just morph from here? Fragment flow chart. Oh, you can morph within the within the, the scene that you're doing. Okay. And global flow chart. All right. Let's go to the team select. Okay. All right. So we've done a D team and a Q team. Now time for the best team. All right. We gotta do chainsaw, right? We gotta do chain like like it's calling to me. We d we did the gun, we did the crossbow. Now we gotta do chainsaw, right? We have to. Oh, should we do their? Should we do two C team scenes? Should we do that one, their their version of the button, and then the chainsaw as a treat? Let's do that. And then we'll do chainsaw. First come, first saved. C. Okay. This is oh. called the decontamination room. I think you're supposed to clean off after returning from the surface. Well, that was for when there was a nuclear war and the world was contaminated. Ah, uh, that explains the shower heads. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just as I thought. <laughs> this won't open either. The map shows an elevator hall beyond this door. If we came down the elevator normally, why do I love Himbo so much? I, I didn't. I didn't know this about myself. Just like handsome, good-natured, but also a little dumb men. I don't know why. I just fucking love them. Like just fuck. Just oh my god. I love him. We'd be able to run into this room immediately, but. What about that? It's connected to the lounge. I checked it earlier, but no dice. Locked up tight. Do you think Zero trapped us in here to make us play the decision game? The king of him. It's pretty bows. obvious at this point. 1810. I do. Uh... I think it was about 1330 when we finished voting and the drug put us to sleep. So that means we were napping like toddlers for four and a half hours. Not necessarily. Junpei, I have something I've been wanting to ask you. How are you here? During the vote earlier, you told Carlos. Come on, Carlos, vote for Q team. Yeah, what about it? What happened what to you, about? Junpei? How could you be so horrible? You, you're you the used reason. To... You'd never have said that a year ago. <laughs> oh, like you're one to talk. <laughs> What? What? What happened to you, Junpei? What happened while I was gone? I'd like to know more about you, too. <laughs> What's that, Carlos? Does that mean you're interested in me? Ooh. No. My focus is my little sister. Wait, what? I've got no time for a love life. Heh. So our hero of justice has a sister complex. Junpei? Carlos really is worried about you. Well, it's more I want to know about you both. <laughs> Weren't you friends as kids? And last year you were trapped just like this and escaped together. So why? Why the animosity, you mean? That's exactly why. Junpei. I've seen people die. Horrible, cruel deaths I never wanted to see. So many. I'm probably becoming numb. Oh, the music. Yeah. After what happened last year, I quit school and joined a detective firm. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> what made you want to do that? It was all because of Akane there. 
She up and disappeared, so I went to a firm to try and find her. It's small, but known to work among the underground. I've snuck into places running human organ trafficking like they're trading cookies. <laughs> Saw a co-worker I just him. finished eating with pushed off a rooftop the other day. Never had a by-the-books case where I just had to prove he cheated. Every job that passed my hands was dirty and dangerous. It's because of you, Akane. That's when I realized. Humans aren't as beautiful as I thought. I'd only been skimming the surface all this time. So every day... After work, I'd drink myself to sleep. I slept in my bathtub with the shower running. Uh, what? It was the only way I was able to get the scent of blood off me. That's a horrible. Oh, man. But last month, finally. Finally. I got the scent of blood off I me. I got intel through our network that Akane was joining this experiment. So that's why you came to DCOM. <laughs> yeah, I threatened those in charge and forced my way in. What? What? Akane, why didn't you send him a letter or something? Hello, Akane here. Like... Damn, those shower heads. Um... So, um, Akane, how's Santa? Uh, I mean, Aoi. My brother. I heard about Ace. He's stuck in jail if he hasn't escaped yet. Lotus is doing all right. She's working and raising her kids still. Well, what 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 is this continuity? What what is this like? Actually taking time out to like talk about past characters that you may have had some investment with instead of like, oh fucking no, it's not the mummy at all. Let's talk about fucking Dio. He's a fucking clown. Oh, left hand doesn't know what the right hand's doing. Oh, just fucking Dio. What 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 is this? What is? Who told you this? That detective guy, Seven. Yeah. I worked with him once. We destroyed Free the Soul's headquarters. <laughs> destroyed? <laughs> of course you did. Hey, uh, what's Free the Soul? <laughs> a religious cult. <laughs> They're a freaky terrorist organization who never stop trying to create their new world. They abducted my brother and I ten years ago. And the game we played last year was related to that big kidnapping case. My brother and I were trying to track Free the Soul's movements, but... You were too, Junpei? I came across some info on them while I was working. Seven was the one still on their trail. But I kind of think we went too far by destroying their headquarters. I'm pretty sure we pissed off their boss. I, I think his name was Brother. Oh, this is important? So wait, you're saying the Zero the Second has something to do with him? No, I'm not saying that. You know anything about it, Akane? I already told you, I'm not connected to this. Why are you here then? I don't know why this person is calling themselves Zero. Why don't you enlighten us as to why you joined DCOM, Akane? Junpei. I agree. Someone using that name has thrown us into a similar game. No way you can ask me to believe they're unrelated. I agree with Grumpy. Stop it, Junpei. <laughs> From what I can tell, Akane's the victim. Stop it, Junpei. Stop it, Junpei. Says it like Junpei's in like a bad place. Like, like he, he's he's going for a second tub of ice cream because he's sad about a breakup. And Carlos is across the kitchen table and he's like, "Stop it, Junpei! That's enough ice cream, Junpei! You get out of this funk. We're gonna go out and we're gonna go pick you up, someone. You know, like you." <laughs> Stop it, Junpei! From what I can tell, Akane's the victim. <laughs> And so are you. You guys need to get over this. I'm here to change the future. Oh, okay. Huh? Free the Soul is currently attempting to implement a terrifying plan. I infiltrated the experiment to stop that. So you knew that this game would happen? I don't know. I didn't know any specifics about all of this. But you just said it's to change the future. A very distant future. So you access the morphogenetic field and... D Hold up. <laughs> what are you talking about? Zero, cut this off. Come on, button time. A little late, perhaps. <laughs> I now announce the voting results. It's like he was listening. Like he's like, okay, hold on. Alright, this is probably...
probably a good moment. Here we go. <laughs> Ooh, uh, why do you have to interrupt now? Eternity is a weird choice of words. You mean this button? Oh, whoops, I pressed it. Uh, Zero, what does the button do? The other two teams are listening to a message just like this one. Doubt. What? The construction of all of them are the same. A yellow button exists on the wall in each. Oh, that thing. <laughs> Pressing it activates the showers in the other wards. Oh, let's clean them. They will rain down a solution of hydrogen fluoride. Hydrogen fluoride? Tell us about it. It's not only acidic enough to melt a body, but it even dissolves glass and iron. Explaining what would happen if you were under it seems unnecessary. Explain it. Button on the wall is your way to freedom. Using it will kill the other teams, and you will obtain the needed X passes to escape. I have one final thing to tell you. The early bird gets the worm. After the first team pushes it, the button will become inactive for both of the other teams. Your time limit is three minutes. What will you do? Will you press it? Or refuse? It is ultimately all up to you to decide. Isn't it obvious? Junpei! Wait! Let's think about this! Get out of my way, Akane. We need to push the button before the other teams do. What are you saying, Junpei? Are you really planning to sacrifice everyone else so you can escape? It's to survive. It's kill or be killed. So we need to make sure to kill them first. Junpei. Grumpy. One year. And you've changed so much. You couldn't write a letter. Uh, oh man! Damn you! Do you want to die? Holy shit! No wonder the weebs hate this game. Like a character that they loved went through character development. They don't know how to handle this. They're like, oh, 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 oh what the fuck? Why is it exactly the same with the same fucking thing? Like I understand. Like, what the fuck? Oh, oh, why is it just the same fucking? I, 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 this is way out of my comfort zone. Like, like this is this is fucking like actual like holy shit. Like it's not even like oh little puppy dog change either. Like this guy is really fucking different. Like this is good. You're okay with never seeing your sister again. Maria. Maria. <laughs> no way in hell I'm dying. I did not go through everything just to die today. And then he pushes the no, button. don't, Carlos. <laughs> if none of the teams push it, then it has to be like when we voted. Well, you're wishing on a star. We'll end up killed. Junpei. Push it, Carlos. It's been three minutes. Does that mean none of the teams? It has to mean no one pushed it. Oh, that was the longest 180 seconds ever. I counted. <laughs> You're telling me. Oh, Grumpy was wrong. I'm really drowning in my own sweat. Wrong, wrong, <laughs> like wrong. Like I practically wrong. had that acid bath already. Hmm. It seems there may be a misunderstanding, so I shall clear it up for you. I never said the showers would activate as soon as the button was pressed. He never said that. Which means, you've yet to learn whether the button has been activated by someone or not. What? No! Then when?
can, will we? Less than a minute left before we're knocked out. That means... So you're saying we won't even know until we're already melted into goo? We're not going to be able to hug down there. So this was complete, completely pointless. Great. Completely pointless. Alright, it's chainsaw time. Where was that? Don't press. Oh. Wait, hold on. What happens if I press the button? If I press the button, something happens? Like, right away? I'm guessing if you press the button, it, it makes the acid turn on on yourself or something. Uh, that was the antidote. Antidote, getting the antidote wrong. Interesting. Hmm. Alright. Let's go. It's chainsaw time. And if we have time for this, we'll do the other shower scene with um, with Q Team Suspicion. This is the pantry. Oh, this oh, is the jumpy hey, head Carlos, one. Where's Junpei? Grumpy, sorry. No idea. Nice pose. He'll be gone when I woke up. King. Locked. Wait. <laughs> Not quite, but almost. <laughs> Did Junpei do this? You think he woke up first and then locked us in? It's been a long time since you've seen each other, right? Maybe now he's Zero's accomplice. That's not possible. The Junpei I know would never do something like that to us. Yeah, he's not the Junpei you know. Sorry. It was just one of the possibilities. <laughs> Junpei. My bad. Sorry. You know, this has been on my mind for a while. But what exactly is he to you, Akane? It's hard to believe that you two just knew each other in grade school. Junpei. He's very... Yes. He's very important to me. And called and write. All my life, I've never really had many friends to call my own. That's surprising. I would have taken you as the type guys and girls all fawn over in Japan. Ooh. Hold on. That's that's the second suggestion that, you know, like, guys and girls. Like, damn. Damn, Carlos. Seriously. Oh, you're very kind. Thank you. But that's not exactly... Junpei always said, I was a girl who always said what shouldn't be said. Yeah. I never found myself bullied or anything. That's true. But it still seemed as if people considered me something of an odd girl. That's pretty true. That's pretty Junpei fucking true. Was different. He told me he'd rush to my aid whenever I was troubled. Once, when we were young, I was crying over something and he faced the enemy alone. Wow, how specific. It sounds like he's a comic book hero. <laughs> yes. To me, he is at the. <laughs> this is... Someone wrote this, and then she said it. Once, when we were young, I was crying over something, and he faced the enemy alone. What the fuck is that? Great vegetables, tear bullshit. What? <laughs> Very least. But this past year has completely changed him. Seems to me like he's the exact opposite now. Yeah, it's so weird. If it was because of me somehow, then this time I need to rush to his aid. That's what I've decided anyway. Just, just one phone call, Akane. You really like Junpei, don't you? Oh, hold on, hold on. Yes! yes! <laughs> this eye is super fixated on something. <laughs> what in the 
world are you saying, Carlos? Ooh. I'm out of my depth when it comes to romance. Whoa, hey, my don't say that. My coworkers do always come to me with their stories, though. I'm, I'm a good listener. So I can tell. Of course you are. Just by looking, I can tell if someone's in love. Does that mean there isn't anyone like that for you? That important? There is. Oh. I love my little sister very much. She's a sunshine of my life. Okay. Oh, so a sister complex. <laughs> ha ha. You're horrible. Consider it payback for earlier. Now then. Nothing will come from just sitting around here. How about we find a way out? Right. I bet you're eager to see your dearest love as soon as you can. Ah, oh, Carlos! Even the conversations just flow better. There's like little callbacks. It doesn't waste a lot of time with, with like bullshit as usual. Oh man, Jumpy's been cut up into pieces. Like this is... Oh, he's... Th he's okay, alright. Huh? What's this? It's round. Maybe it's a knob for a machine? Round part. T-shape. A round yellow part. If you look closely, you can see a tiny triangle. Maybe it's a machine part. Okay. L door. R door. What? Oh, oh, Carlos, the potatoes are cut up into round pieces. You're right. It's time to fire up the grill and chow down. On second thought, I don't feel much like eating while we're stuck here. God, God, man. Is there more of a, a better... What the fuck this is? A left leg? Is Zero trying to scare us? Wait, hold on. This leg looks so real disgusting. What the hell, Zero? Put something like that in there. Is, is it just actually... Is it actually grumpy? Oh, it's powder to make gelatin. Like, is it really? Like, it fucking hell. Is, I hope it's a fake out. Gelatin powder is mostly for baking, but it has uses in everyday cooking too. Of course you know that. Oh, Carla, Carlos, I didn't know you like to cook. My mom's the one. I've seen her use it in a stew or pasta sometimes. What a nice mother. Nice mother. I'm a little jealous. It was a long time ago, but the memory is still so clear in my head. Man, best boy. It looks like an actual leg. Nothing else special about it. All right, we're just we're just leaving it. We're we're, we're just leaving it. All right, another leg. Oh, okay. Uh, this is. The left arm, pretty sure it's fake. Damn, no use, it's locked on the wrist. There's a spot for a key. Maybe there's one around here somewhere. All right. Gelatin recipe, needs to be chilled. Okay, so we're making the gelatin man. Powder, water, mold in here, okay. Oh, we should probably click on it. A recipe for gelatin, it's nice of them to draw it out, but it's kind of vague. If there's a recipe, then there's probably ingredients too. You should make some and give it to Jumpy when we see him. I made it just for you. No, I'm not bold enough to say something like that. That's too bad. A girl like you saying that would definitely capture his heart. And his heart's probably around here somewhere, so you could do that. Is there anything in this box? Oh, some crackers. These would go perfectly with tea. The packaging makes them look good, but I can't say I have much of an appetite. Let's see. There's nothing we can use here. Did you know about glycerin? Oh, shit. Ah, what is this? Is this a torso? Okay, Carlos, is this real? Why would you th Why would you think that, Akane? It's just a realistic fake. Is it? You're right, it couldn't be real. I feel like you're being a little vague at how this is. It says iodine solution. It can't be grumpy. There's no way they would do that. Iodine solution in a bottle. I remember being told as a kid to never put any of it in my mouth. And the more you're told not to, the more you want to do it. Did you try it? I was curious, and I, but I knew a boy who, who did, and he got severely reprimanded as a result. Let me guess. Jumpy? Man, what a guy. Uh, that explains a lot. Actually, I have no idea what happens if you would do that. It's very made human torso. No need to look at this again. All right. What about the other side? This side here. No. No. Can't do that one. Okay. Nothing useful up here. Let's keep looking around. Ah, this is a a right leg. Is you're trying to scare us with a mannequin? Oh, check status. All right. Spoiler from chat. Here we go. Here we go. Ooh. Oh, it is these all the time. Interesting. Okay. Let's move the leg and see. If you get hungry, come back here. But there's no need to do that now. Man, Grumpy really fell apart without you, Akane. <laughs> hey, Carlos, this part looks sort of like a drawer. But, uh, nope, can't open it without a handle. 
There's preserved food in these boxes. We need. We don't need them right now. If this was a Germa stream, that joke would have been good. All right, what's wrong with the air duct, Carlos? Carlo, nothing. I just thought maybe we could get it out that way. It's too. It's way too small even for me. You're right. We'll have to think of another way. You can put the correct password in. The door should open. Four digits. Okay, let's give it a shot. Air four. Hmm, guess the number's wrong. All right. Okay, this is gonna be. Oh man, it's gonna do something. I'm guessing these buttons are somehow are how you open the lock. Oh shit. Okay. Nope. I guess random button presses won't work. Okay, what? Okay, I actually don't know what to do. I can see a bottle and a card on the other side of the glass. The door is locked. What's up with all these pink lines? If you slide them both together, what would you get? Some kind of blue doll on a right arm. This glass is locked, but there's a bunch of lines are all over it too. That would make like an L, E, F, T, left, 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 What the hell would that be? I don't want to use my... I, 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 both of my memos are, are, are full. These two must be together, right? Or is it is that an L again? Or an I? H? No. Okay, let's keep looking around. I thought I'd be able to kick this wooden door down. Zero wouldn't lock us in a place that'd be that easy to escape from. Let's keep looking. Okay. Ooh, what's that? Can we use that over there? No, that's that that's nothing. This is really nothing? Okay. Power seems to be off on this machine. Doesn't the hole in this panel look like a gingerbread man? I wonder what it could be. Power's off. Yes, machine powered on. This depression on the panel must be the power switch. Let's see if we can use it. Well, now that the power's on, what's with the rest of this hole? I don't know. Maybe our hand goes in? Nothing's happening. What is just what is this for? Tiny shit shoot hole. Tiny shit shoot hole. I don't want I don't I wanna like look at this. This is a thermo fridge. You can be used to heat or cool items put inside. Alright, can we open it? No? I feel like this should have done something, but it's not. But let's put some powder in. Okay, it's not doing anything. Maybe we do have to do the, the thing over there. Maybe we do have to do this. Or did I just miss something really obvious somewhere? Can't go through this door, right? God, the door of this freezer is locked and won't budge. Is there a place to get the code, maybe? Wait, wait, wasn't there like something to do with like door somewhere with left or something? Hold on, left, le left door, right, right, door. L door, right, right door, left. Six inputs, just left all the way. No. Maybe there's a hint somewhere. Yeah, maybe there is a hint somewhere. 
These are kind of suspicious. Can we like drop the iodine on them? Don't potatoes change when iodine solution is dropped on them? Yes, the starch reacts with the iodine and turns purple. Oh, look, the letters appeared. That means the experiment was successful. Do, do, doodle, doodle. Okay, so um, down, up, down, left, left, right is for the left door to go to the right. So down, up, down, left, left, right. And for the other door, it's right, left, left, down, up, down. All right, so doodler. I wonder what it means. I have no idea. What about L door and right door? So down, up, down, left, left, right. Down, up, down, left, left, right. Down, up, down, left, left, right. Okay, let's try this one. Down, up, down, left, left, right. Okay, so it's the other one. Down, up, down, left, left, right. Okay, did I did I did, did I did it wrong, didn't I? I put up first. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The give, give me a I'm fucking tired, okay? Father four, okay? With a three-year-old who just will not shut up, all right? How the colors of the potatoes were in after all. I never would have imagined something I learned in grade school would help me now. All right. Okay, so now it's backwards, right? Right, left, left, down, up, down again. All right. So the reaction to the iodine test was if it is, wasn't him for the store. So now we can get the things inside. All right. Left hand what left hand plus I don't even know what that is plus doll what what is do d o I don't know what that is Wait, someone's on the screen. Aw, oh, shit. I think it's done. Hey! Carlos, look, the drawer. Let's see what's in it. Some kind of mold? Okay, so now we just need some water. What is this exactly? It kind of looks like a cookie cutter, but it has a bottom. Maybe it's for gelatin? Gelatin, huh, I see. Okay, we need some water. All right. Left hand plus... Oh, it is doll. Plus, left hand plus doll equals... Left hand plus doll, huh? Okay, well, that's the right hand. It's a handcuffed right arm. I doubt it's real, but that's no reason to keep looking at this creepy thing. Arm can't remove, but we can take the doll. Okay. Blue doll. It's jumpy. Carlos, this blue doll, it feels cold. It was in the refrigerator. Of course it's cold. It makes me think of those cold packs you use when you have a fever. I doubt anyone would ever put that doll on their face, Akane. Eh. Wow, we are these instructions? It shows a doll, but it's saying we should heat it up. Warm, cool. Alright. Left hand plus doll. Water. It could be useful. Let's take it with us. All right, bottle of water. Let's combine it with the gelatin. No. Okay, and then we combine it. All right, we did it. All right, cool. Nice. This is going so well. Use this to heat our cool items. Cool. Let's cool this down. All right. Oh, it turned solid. Now we have gelatin. All right, let's eat it. 
Oh, wow, Carlos, Carlos, it's so jiggly. It might, it might look dish delicious, but there's no sugar in it. It won't taste good. Well, you just ruined my appetite. Why is reality so cruel? Life, sim life is simply unfair. This depression, maybe we can put the gelatin in it. Huh, I heard a sound from below the machine. Oh look, the drawer at the bottom opens. Yeah, that's a, I want key, I wonder what it's for. A small key, a key, it's pretty small, what's it for? I don't know, let's try using every keyhole we find. I agree, this is a good plan. Okay, do I need to warm up the doll before I put it with the left hand or what? Thank you to fix the bars, reason for that. Wasn't, didn't we need a key? No. A fake arm is attached to a bar and handcuffed. Bars on the place can't remove it. Okay, really? I thought I thought left hand plus doll, right? That seems to be about right, right? Do I need to heat it up first? Why why would that matter? Look at that, the color turned pale pink. He's been trapped in that refrigerator so long that his skin turned blue. I feel kinda of bad for this little guy now. Okay, a one, two, three, four. The doll turned pale. The number 1234 is on stomach. Look close. I thought it was ketchup, but it looks like it was written with blood. Ketchup, really? You have to admit that it'd be pretty funny z zero using ketchup to write this out. Yes, I agree. That would have been pretty funny. For the next game, iconic. 1234. Okay. Uh, is that the code to the door? Because that seems fucking bonkers to me. Like this. Please can't remove it. Okay. Why does it say left, left hand doll? Oh, okay. What's on the left hand then? So the doll is one, two, three, four. What? What's? Can we? What's on the left? Is there just something up here that we just need to move, and we're just not doing it? Oh, oh, okay. Yes, the arm has been freed. Okay. Five five two nine or or six two five. Something's written on the palm. Five two and a and a nine. No 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 no. This is a six two five. Fool fool me once. Shame on you. Fool fool me twice. Won't be won't be fooled again. All right. So what is one two one two three four plus uh plus six six two five? That's one eight five. Nine, one eight five nine, right? One eight five nine. Am I right? One eight five nine. One eight five nine. Hey, ba, 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 ba. all right, completed. Left hand plus stall was a hint for the freezer. Yes, but it only opened the the cover. We have another step. All right. It looks like a hand mark. Maybe it needs a, a palm print. Let's see if my right hand will work. Well, my hand isn't it. Want to give it a try, Akane? It didn't work. My hand isn't the right one either. Neither of us are. Neither of our hands are right. Then whose hand is? All right, let's go get it. It's this one. This could work on the handcuff. Yes, it worked. We got the arm. All right. The right arm is is, is a fake. It's strangely cold. It's in a fist too. Oh, does that mean? No, I really don't think it wants to win at rock paper scissors. All right, let's go put it in the microwave and, and heat it up. And because otherwise we're not going to be able to open it to put it on the thing. We can change temperature. All right, here we go. Uh, the hand it opens. It got all warm and soft. Uh, this whole gimmick is really gross. Awesome. It's a fake right arm. Heating it causes the hand to open. Did you play rock paper scissors with it, Carlos? Well, what? Like I would do something so childish. All right, here I was thinking that he was hiding the fact that it's real, but no. He's still lost. All right, we were. <laughs> damn it! How did you know I was gonna do rock? Every single time. Just damn. All right, we were right. This is this is need to authenticate. Cause I'll rock your world, bro. I wonder what's inside. Let's open the door. All right, is this the jumpy head time? Uh oh. No, no, no way. You've got to be kidding me. It's got to be fake, right? I...
all right, I will respect the hell out of the game if um if if it is actually grumpy and they killed him and they were like like messing with his limbs this whole time. That would be so unexpected. I will I will respect the hell out of it. All right, here we go. I don't think this is a fake. All right. I don't think this is fake. Wait, what? What? Now announcing the current casualties. D team, Diana, Phi, Sigma, C team, Junpei. Holy shit! These four are now deceased. As a result, four X passes will be revealed. Blue, red, milk, jump. Jump? That is all. Horrible! So horrible! Who would do such a thing? This room is locked. So, the one who killed Junpei is one of us. Carlos? No, no, Himbo, no! That's not the right conclusion at all! No, someone else could have locked it. No, no, what are you doing? Oh. Damn it! Damn it! Break, damn you! Oh, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I didn't have faith. I'm sorry. I'm so the game tests your faith. Whew. I'm so sorry. I apologize. I, I feel so bad right now. I shouldn't have doubted. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Church of Carlos, will will you will you let me continue? I'm sorry. Oh man. I seriously doubt I thought I thought I really did. I won't I won't lie, I really did. <sighs> Connie? She had the same conclusion. Here we go. Take this! <laughs> Damn. Now that Grumpy's out of the equation. I was gonna try and hit on both of you at the same time, but you know, I'll take this. <laughs> Let's make a Carlos sandwich and you guys will be the bread. this would happen all I wanted was to get that five hundred thousand dollars <laughs> if only I could save her just save Maria it's all I wanted and now oh what huh. no For example hmm say there's a PC with basic low-end components <laughs> We played a number of videos all at once on it. <laughs> what would happen? The processing speed slows down, of course. Oh yeah, he's like, yeah, I would you. It's not much better than if the computer had froze. It's true. What's so happening with your younger sister is similar. You're saying she needs a new computer? All right, I'm gonna go get that five hundred thousand dollars to get her that new computer. I don't know how much they cost, but I know computers are probably expensive. That's techno, techno gadget. All right, Doc, I'm going. <laughs> No, no, so that's almost saying this isn't carbon monoxide poisoning, but right. With Maria, her brain and nervous system seem to be perfectly fine. She has radical six. We couldn't figure out the cause until now. Other patients with the same symptoms began appearing recently. And they have reverie syndrome. A variety of moments flicker in and out of the mind, as if one was constantly dreaming. Turns out you have reverie syndrome. That's why it's called though. the You're normal or reverie syndrome. All right. There have been no complete recoveries as of yet. But However, it seems with the newest medical technology, 
A few cases have been successful at relieving the symptoms. Then please, you must do the same for her. Does little Maria have insurance? You uh, do understand what's required for treatment, yes? If I did, she'll... Maria will... Well, I mean, I want to say, like, this does definitely doesn't happen in Canada, but I also want to continue and say this definitely doesn't happen in Canada because Maria actually got to see a doctor, you know, and is actually in a hospital in a bed. So it's like, yeah, so, you know, can't, you know, glass, glass houses, you know, glass houses. So that means I... I absolutely can't die here. That's why you killed Junpei, isn't it? What? What did you say? You figured you needed to kill someone to save your sister. And that's why you... Oh, man. Whoa, what, what are you talking about? Don't play dumb! Mira better watch out. Did you forget that you and I are the only ones in this ward? So it's obvious the killer is... Gab. Uh, it had to have been you, Carlos. Gab. <laughs> Connie, calm down. Is he hiding the axe? Oh, calm. Like Clover? <sighs> okay, you're right. I'm the only other one here. But I... That's what you're leading it's with? definitely you who killed him. Wait, stop! You say that, but maybe you're the one who really did it. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> and now you're going totally nuts with that chainsaw. I don't believe this. No matter what, even if the world went topsy turvy this very second, I'd. So I'm going to be the next one you kill, huh? Uh I'm sorry, did he just, like, cock the axe like a shotgun? What- what- what the fuck was that? What- what did he- <laughs> The special fucking firefighter technique? Like, I heard, like, a when he fucking held it. What the fuck was that? Two more people die, you can return to your darling little sister. Wow, hey Akane. Now, if you kill me, your probability of escape gets pretty high. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh. What? Why'd she run away? Did she feel too threatened by me with this axe? No. Think. Tell me. <laughs> think it over again. <laughs> Just like any other Code 3. Once 90 minutes are up, an injector in your bracelet will activate. An anesthetic and an agent to erase your memories will be administered. Okay. So after we voted at 1330, we were hit with the anesthetic. And then she just jumps off the balcony with a chainsaw and just fucking takes him out while he's doing this. What the fuck is going on? Hold on, I don't even understand. What what was this response? If two more people die, you can return to your darling little sister. Hey now! If you kill me, your probability of escape gets pretty high. Okay. See how instantly the 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 portrayal of people who are like murderous just becomes like completely unhinged in this way, like If two eh? more people die, you, know, like, you can return. To they can never be like that. I love that zero is in the fucking the list there. We awoke in the pantry after 1800. It's 4 hours of time not accounted for. What was I doing during that time? Killing Was I really sound asleep then, or I just can't remember what happened because of the drugs I was given? Maybe Akane was right, and I. Oh. What? Blackout? No, Akane had run off towards control. 
It might be possible to turn off the lights there. So she did kill Junpei? <laughs> and she's coming for me. What the fuck is this scene? She puts the chainsaw. What do I do? What the hell should I do? <laughs> Think calmly, rationally. Who is the most threatening person here right now? M me. Whoever it was who killed Junpei. So what I need to do is remove that person. Wait, what? Even if it ends up being me. <laughs> hearted and you understand that why would you think that you're capable of doing something like that he's he's actually gonna do it isn't he he's actually gonna do it he's gonna do it he's, he's... no what the hell am i thinking <laughs> there's no way it could be me so then then ah there you are damn it just who did it what did the dog just talk Who killed Jumpy? Zero. You do not know identity. Why does that matter? Z zero two. Air. The dog. How would a dog do? <laughs> Q, not likely to be Q team, but not impossible. I like that. I like to think that this is actually Carlos's thoughts. Not likely to be Q team, but how would how would how would a dog do it? <laughs> it was himself. Chumpy did it. The dead cannot kill anyone. Like he wasn't dead when he killed himself. How is zero not a valid option? Do not know. I can't accuse him. I don't know the identity. Okay, of no one, nobody, nobody did it. Error. No, no one. No, no space one. A uh, sigma. The dead cannot kill anyone. Mira. Not likely to be Q team. Maria. Error. I don't know. Honestly, I'm starting to think maybe it was us. I'm coming around. <laughs> what was it, Kate? Katie? Error. It had to have been Akane. If it wasn't us, I guess <sighs> this doesn't seem right. This this is dumb. This is dumb. Like so, you're saying that, and then we stash his body and put his thing, and then set up the escape room. Come on, game. Like it, it has to be zero. Eric. All right, I'm going to Kane. No, it's. I'm going Carlos. It, it's funnier to see what happens. What does he do? Core! 
worse. Akane, she'd never do something like that to Junpei. He's very... Yes, he's very important to me. If that's the case, then I'm... I'm the only one who could have killed him. It might have been a demon possessing me. Or maybe it was some kind of parasite. Or I'm under hypnosis? Whatever it was, I'm... Regardless of the reason, I was the... And then I forgot I did it because of the damn amnesia drug. Carlos? Don't come any closer. I'm dangerous. <laughs> my body moves against my will. I might kill you next. <laughs> if that's how it is, then... Carlos, no! Oh, wait, no. Why did this happen? You were about to kill him. Mom, Dad. I won't let anyone die. It was me. Man, Carlos is like the opposite of Alice in every way, huh? Damn. Selfless, kind hearted, hot. Just damn. Okay, where was that? What? And then we just go, we just continue Carlos by himself. <laughs> what? It was Akane, and then we just kill her, and then this is just fucking, like, four non-stop hours of Carl- Okay, this is the best path. Let's do it. Let's do it. Long stream today. Let's fucking do it. I don't give a shit. Let's go. Here we go. Just Carlos leaves the, the, the game. He gets the money. He goes back into this historian. It becomes a VN about him living with his sister. Like, <laughs> fucking, who cares? Let's do it. All right. All right. I, I guess Akane is the only other one. Akane. It's going to say no. Can't be. You need something else. No, it's letting me do it. Okay. That's right. Akane. She has to be the one. Kill Junpei. Die! Akane, why did you kill him? I told you I didn't. I didn't kill him! Um... Oh man, the blood. Uh... <sighs> are, are we... <sighs> Put it back on. Put some stuff on it. Uh, Carlos? Oh, I knew it. You... Self-defense. No. I didn't kill. Junpei. I'm 
Sorry. I couldn't avenge you. Akane? I... I just killed... All right. <laughs> Time to put the axe to your neck or something? Like, what? Oh, okay. All right. So, in that timeline, there are five dead, right? Who was... Q team is the only one that's surviving. Okay. Cool. All right. So, we're at three hours and 33 minutes. I don't think we have time to do another escape room. However, we can do the shower room with Q, and then we can probably end it there so we don't go so we don't go over. Um, I think that's what we're going to do. Shower team with Q. And hopefully that doesn't go uh, too long. We had a bit of a late start today because uh, we had something to do in the house. So, apologies about that. Wait, I promise you, Carlos. What do you mean? We did do, we did two Carloses. We did we already did the shower scene with Carlos. All right, All right let's do this now. There is no Carlos through. It didn't go. I, I didn't lie. The game did. Let us out! Let us out of here! How long are you planning on doing that? Bang all you want, it won't open. <sighs> Damn it. Just take a second, calm down. Joe doesn't we get it. Joe doesn't get what? What don't I get? What is what is there to not get at the moment? Full heads. The flow chart shared with you. I know that! I just I just said that. Hey! Ooh. What the hell are you doing? I'm sorry. Do you know what that button does? Nope. Well, no, but... I just like pushing buttons. Maybe the door opens with it. True. I I really wasn't going to push it, though. <sighs> Kids are a pain. But he could have a very good point. We haven't heard anything from Zero. Just sitting around here is useless. Maybe just one tiny push? Hey, Mira. Just kidding. I'm not that reckless. I mean, I would have pushed the button by now. Don't scare me like that. But we really don't know much at all. We may be at the point of crazy decisions. The only thing we know for sure is what time it is. 18.08. It must have been around 13.30 when we fell asleep in the lounge. So, uh... Four and a half hours? Wow, you calculated that fast. Um. And at your age, even. <laughs> well, was it good? I was just about to say the same thing. Seems you still have that problem with numbers, Eric. I recall you having trouble calculating change when we first met. Hey, come on now. At the ice cream Is store? Is that how you two met? At the ice I cream wanna store. I want to hear, I want to hear. I don't. Yeah? Oh, My God. My face has got to be all red. With blood. I still remember every detail. Oh, God. The fateful encounter was on a Monday. The sky that morning in Nebraska was full of thick clouds, though the gloom cleared in an instant, like a miracle. I always mustered up my best smile for customers. Press the button. Even the boring regulars I was tired of seeing. I still offered the most delicious ice cream to them. I was getting sick of it, though. Oh, now, don't think it was my work I was unsatisfied with. I really, truly love ice cream. But as the days passed, everything felt hollow. As if there was a hole in my heart. And then Mira came and filled it, and then stole it. I thought it was just another normal day. I wasn't expecting the moment it changed. I couldn't believe my eyes. I didn't think such a beautiful sight existed in this world. My god, the feelings that hit me. I'd never felt anything like that before. That was when I realized this this had to be a miracle. 
Was it like a new tub of ice cream that was just perfectly smooth at the top and didn't have that little bit of a gap in one of the one of the edges too? Like absolutely perfectly uniformly smooth. And none of the ice cream was on the lid either when you opened it. You're just like, oh my god, undisturbed ice cream. That's, that's pretty good. Mm-hmm. Mira entered my oh, life. Oh, it's Mira, never mind. She was an angel that looked like a customer. Uh, shouldn't it be the other way? The details aren't important. <laughs> you look like you don't understand. Well, I don't blame you. I didn't get it either. Mira was just such a vivacious vision of beauty. I was just a lowly ice cream shop employee. Next to that... Still are. There was no way I would be a good match. And yet... But then Mira... Cut it out. Me, an angel? <laughs> you gotta be kidding. But it's true. You really are an angel to me, Mira. <laughs> uh, it's like you're a completely different person now, Eric. Huh? Well, earlier you were being... Well, your face was pretty scary. Did I frighten you that much? Yeah. Oh. Gosh, I'm so sorry. Uh, it's okay. You were probably just rattled about what's happened to us. I'm sorry, chat. Like, this game, like, d made you think that it was fake, but they actually did chop up the body of the protagonist of the first game, put the parts around an escape room, had you use them as props, put a hand in a microwave to fucking, like, loo the fist, use it to open the door, and then find the punchline that is in its head, and this is the worst one? That was amazing! What the fuck? How bad is the ending of this game? Like, what does it do? Does it does it go to your house and fuck your mom specifically? Like, like how bad does this have to end? Like, holy shit. I could tell you were a nice person under all that. <laughs> what are you... You're an odd duck. <laughs> Looks like you've gone back to your dopey expression again. I guess you've calmed down, huh? Dopey? <laughs> Man, you're really harsh, Mira. But yeah, I'm okay now. That's uh, right, I'm fine. Uh, I can definitely smile no matter what. Okay. Hmm. I wonder why Zero decided to lock us up in here anyway. Right. Seems like too much effort for it to be just a joke. A lot of money was pumped into this whole thing. Maybe all of this is supposed to be part of the GCOM experiment? They wanted to investigate how a closed space affected change on emotions, right? But then why did they want normal people like us to apply? Wouldn't you want people in helpful professions to go to Mars? Like military officials, researchers, other skilled professionals like that. Mars needs Maybe ice cream. the reason they chose civilian subjects is because they're planning to send those kinds of people to Mars in the future. DLC for oh, senpais. That sounds right. Strangers living together on Mars for an extended period of time. What kind of problems would that bring? How would the subjects figure out solutions to the resulting troublesome situations? According to the DCOM staff, that's what the experiment was trying to determine. Like the chair-bound old man. They put us in a difficult position on purpose. To observe how we'd get out. The sponsor is a civilian organization that hopes to expand business worldwide. Wait, what? Maybe they expect to be part of a colonization of Mars in the future. What are we talking about? Colonizing Mars? Hey, have you ever heard this before? If you want to transport live koi from Brazil to Japan, Putting only koi fish in an aquarium will result in most of them dying. But by adding something to that same container, you won't lose a single one. Is it water? What is it? A piranha. A piranha? But how does that even work? I guess their self-preservation instincts kick in. I get it. The fish become so afraid of the piranha that they make an effort to live. That nervous state becomes the power to keep them alive. 
Uh-huh. In order to survive, you need that sense of urgency. I see. What the fuck is this? So, for an actual Mars mission... We were talking about fish and a fucking old man in a chair and fucking, like, piranha and Mars. What the fuck is this? What the fuck? Good idea to have a murderer on the crew, huh? <laughs> Great. This is so good. Oh, kidding. <laughs> he knows. He knew all along. Eric, don't say scary things like that. He literally oh. knows. So maybe all this stuff is something similar. Living quietly in decom becomes boring. So the emotional state will fade. If you intentionally inject a sense of emergency. And here comes Zero. A little late. A little late, bro. Yeah. The voting results. She's done listening to this shit. The other two got the finish. Not Q team. Do I like Eric? No. So the problem with Eric, I think, and, and, and Eric and Mira, is that Mira is not that interesting of a character, and Eric is... So basically, it's it's two characters devoted to one story, because Eric is just like this nothing that's there just, for, just to complement Mira's story. So two characters are devoted to the story that's not very good, and... This other character, Q, who seems actually kind of interesting, um, is is shackled to these two that are combined together that are kind of like, eh, you know? Um, I, I feel like this could have worked if it was more interesting, and it seems like on paper it could have been interesting, but, like, it's not. Like, there's no, there's no like, three-way dynamic playing off the different characters and everything like there is in the other two groups. Um, like, like, Diana should be, like, a nothing character too, right? But, but she's not. I think, like, Sigma and Phi is a good example of that. They're together, and they, and they're both combined, kind of like Mira and, and Eric are. It's just that their story's actually good, and their dynamic is good, whereas this isn't. So, it's just kind of disappointing overall. I don't really like, I don't really like, uh, don't really like Eric. Oh. Will you press it or refuse? It is ultimately all up to you to decide. Oh, we gotta hurry or we'll die! Uh, don't worry. We need to trust the others. The others, you say? The others, what you the say? What the hell do you know? <laughs> hey, stop! <laughs> Where did the nice Eric go? Shut the hell up, you fucking brat! Nice. Wh why, Eric? <laughs> Whoa. Is Q's bandage on backwards? Mira! <laughs> At least he's quiet now. I'll leave the rest of this up to you. Huh? It'll be interesting to see how you handle this. Wh what? Oh, here we go. Here we go. What? 
Wait, it won't let me... Is it fake? It won't let you do it? Just kidding. Second mouse. Decoy mouse. Seems like the other teams didn't press it either. I... I am so glad. <sighs> Are we... safe? Who really knows? Mira? <laughs> what? Watch where you're staring! It seems there may be a misunderstanding, so I shall clear it up for you. Okay, this is gonna be nothing. I never said the showers would activate as soon as the button was pressed. I never said that. Which means you've yet to learn whether the button has been activated by someone or not. What? Then... We'll have to wake up to find out if we're alive or not. Now, it is time for you to sleep. When next you wake, know that you will have no memory of these past 90 minutes. Pleasant dreams. <laughs> no! Her eyes are still open. Her eyes were still open. She blinked. Everyone else see that? Alright. Uh, what's the flow look like now? Let's go with the flow. Kill button Q. Don't press. Yeah, alright. So pressing it actually does do something different. Interesting. Wait. Are they all in a row? Oh. Interesting. Interesting. That's long. Okay. Does it always alternate in the same order? Because this has been red, green, blue, does the next one have to be red? Or could this be anything? It starts with red. It never starts with blue. Who's blue? D team. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, that one's locked. Carlos is sin. Ooh. Oh, am I supposed to say a different name and that stops that from happening? Maybe? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, um... So th can I continue with this right now? Is that what that means? Or does that mean it's that that means there's a lock in the flow if I go oh. over here somewhere? New. Oh, one of them unlocked. One of these is new. I know they all say new, but this one wasn't here before, wasn't it? Oh. They, they each had four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So I think maybe this one is the uh, what we just did there. Huh. Okay. Maybe we'll do that one. Is it eight minutes long? I don't think it's eight minutes long. I'd rather s stop eight minutes early than go 45 minutes over. Like, I need to have dinner with, with, with the family and everything. Um, yeah. Oh, this is five. There's one missing there. Sorry. I thought it was four each. It's exactly eight minutes. Nice. Let's save it. All right.
Yeah, so yeah, again, I'm really enjoying the game so far. It is, uh, it does have problems. Don't get me wrong. It's, it's not like like a fantastic ex experience, you know, or flawless, but um, it is pretty strong. I am very much enjoying it. Uh, I'm curious to see exactly how it's going to go off the rails, um, but I hope it goes off the rails in a uh, in an entertaining way. But yeah, do 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 do. He must be trolling. No, I have taste. Sorry, sorry, I have taste. Sorry. This is bullshit. This is bu I came to these streets to watch him watch these three things, and I wanted him to, to love the first two games and hate this third one, and he doesn't really like the first two games, he doesn't throw This is bullshit. This is not this is not what <laughs> Bad taste taste after all. True. That's true. It's very true. That's very true. Uh anyway, so thank you for uh thank you for stopping by. He doesn't like Eric, therefore his opinions are wrong. What? Why do, why do the weebs love Eric so much? Is it because he's... <laughs> you know what? No. I'm not being mean. I'm not being mean. I'm not doing it. I'm not being mean. I'm not being mean. I'll see you, see you tomorrow. Wait, what day is it? Is it Thursday? Yeah, it is Thursday. Okay, so there's a stream tomorrow. Alright. Stream tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Uh, might possibly go an hour later tomorrow, or maybe not. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah. See you tomorrow. Have a good rest of your day.